Hello, good afternoon. Welcome to Lewis and Ben. Save the world. But also with Daltos today oh, yeah, I'm, in I'm Spirit Island. So this, <laughs> uh, so basically, it's pouring with rain. Me and Ben were like, what shall we do? I fancy playing this board game that we learned to play last week. Me and Daltos learned to play it last week. And Ben's been playing this a bit before, haven't you, already? Um, yeah. We also played it in the office like, a couple of times. Um, went through a phase of playing it a lot. Um, so so lockdown. it's called Spirit Island. It's one of the best get board games out there. You've probably played it, or if you haven't, this is cool. There is a Steve version, but it's only single player um, with screen sharing. So this is like a tabletop sim version. There you go. Look, per position 13 overall rank on BoardGameGeek.com yeah. as of mm. 19th of May this year. It's the I'm top, looking at their... top game. Um, yeah, I mean, it's like two years old as well. So Lots of scripting. The There's a little charts. expansion, which I've never played, which is quite fun. And mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, today we're going to try and save the Spirit Island from the horrible invaders. It's like a cult board game. Mm -hmm. um, the European like colonists are coming to like pillage the resources and enslave the natives. And we, the, the peaceful spirits of the island, will see them off and spook them until they leave us alone. That's right, yeah. So we're just nature. So three player, add expansions. Do you want to have an adversary, Ben? Who shall yeah. we have? England, France, uh, Sweden? Who's I mean, England, terrifying colonial power. Sure. Mm -hmm. How about we have them on level one? Yeah. Uh, although that is quite, that's probably even still going to be quite hard. It's going to be significantly harder than the, like, the default game. The default game is mm. difficulty zero, but we've all played it once. So, ah, mm -hmm. we'll be fine. Um, we might we might lose, which is a very big possibility in these. Yeah, so it's co-op. All three of us, different spirits, tightly and tuned, working together against the evil English. I hate them. Set up the game, right? So this all got this fancy scripting. This is the new frontier, by the way. Uh, the new pirate frontier, guys. Uh, of <laughs> of not having to buy a board game, not having to sit around with your friends, not having to do any of the work to set up the board, just. Press a script button and let it all happen on its own. Although, having said that, you and I both own this board game. So. That's true. We yeah. have paid enough probably to support the board game. Maybe. And if you guys buy it too, then maybe it won't get taken down off of uh, off of tabletop sim. So first of all, you guys need to pick a um, spirit to be. The first four I remember playing before are mm -hmm. kind of like the rivers, um, the lightning, the stone kind of like stone mm -hmm. golem boys and the these green. um shadow guys uh also there's these guys who are fairly early lightning lightning golem people and also the shadows they've all, they've all got different play styles because these mm -hmm. guys are mostly about generating fear and making the english run and pee their pants yeah. and run home and notice England. complexity high <laughs> so. yeah so it's quite yeah, it's, yeah. But some of them Maybe. are quite easy, like these guys who are basically very defensive. They're not very good at killing stuff, but the the, the invaders kind of have trickiness establishing themselves on mm. in their lands. Um, and the stone guy, he's really good at like defending the natives, keeping them alive longer. Oh yeah, so we got so on the board we got forests and deserts, we got wetlands and uh, mountains, we got these little mushrooms which are the natives. They're the Dahan. Yeah. They're, 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 they're like little huts. That the natives live in. Uh, we've got already got some blight on the island. We've already got some invaders. Look, they've already set up a town which is pumping sewage into these mountains. We've got uh. a city here on this coast. Um, some beasts live in this this wetland. There's a bit of disease rife in there as well. These these towns are causing disease. There's another city here. Um, so we'll each spawn on our own board and do our best to try and stop the tide because the spirits are slow to awaken. Right? They've already they've only just noticed that. There's cities all over the bloody mm. place. And uh, we need to do our well, best it, to you know. kick them off our land. Get off our land. We're spirits of nature and eternity. Yeah. Like a few years is like a blink of an eye to us. Mm. 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 Exactly. So, you know, probably probably like 100 years have passed. They've been here 100 years now, and we're like, it's time to oh, show who's boss. <laughs> <sighs> Who yeah. was here first? So some of the bigger spirits obviously aren't, aren't awake because they take even longer to wake up, but... These are these are more of the agile ones, um, and there's some mm. new ones that have been added in this DLC. So the DLC added um, DLC, I'm calling it DLC, the expansion, as it it wasn't even DLC. It was not even DLC, is it? It's p p uh, purchasable content, p purchase loadable content, additional box content, ABC. 
Um, it's got the beasts and it's got the disease and it's got some of these ones down here, which I haven't played with or even seen. Yeah. So you can be a terrifying beast bush with eyes. You could be a tree beard, keeper of the forbidden wilds. You can be just a big fucking fire deer. You can be a, a, a world snake. Uh, you can be a wolf. Mm -hmm. A wolf in the leaves oh, or a cat. Sharp Is that a wolf or a cat? Could be a panther. Uh, it's yeah. both. Bit of both. Oh, the wolf cat. Anyway, yeah. so do you, want, you, cat go, dog. do you guys want to choose your... <laughs> it's a cat dog. You can't see the back of him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bree's here. Does Bree want to join? Bree can join. We can, we can do four. I'm not sure four. if he's streaming or not. We could do a he four way. Went... I think he is streaming. I think I think yeah. I think he is. Um, it's all right. He's got he's squatting up with um, with you. Know, I think they're doing stuff. All right, pick your spirits, boys. Is there a stoat? Uh, there is not a stoat. No stoats. No stoats allowed. That's ridiculous. Oh. <laughs> well, I watched the whole video on stoats last night. <laughs> they're vicious, man. They're, yeah. They're you know they'll they'll kill they'll kill their own babies to get them out of their territory. No. Is that true? Mm -hmm. So get. What their own to get babies out of their territory? Yeah, they have big kit. Their babies are called kits. They have big packs of kits, and then when the kits get too old, they attack them, so they leave their territory. Oh my gosh! Right? Yeah, get out. Anyways, it's a good idea. It's, you know, make them fend for themselves. They have yeah, to that's learn my somehow. Mom did. That's what a lot of people's mums are like when they're eighteen. You know, it's like she was my mum when I was eighteen. Was like, get get out. And said she attacked me. <laughs> And um, bit me. <laughs> Threw Roxy. Didn't want to. Didn't wasn't trying to kill me, but just was had enough. Just had, had enough. Mm. And I understand. I understand. Um, what are you guys going to be? A cat versus the British Empire. Um, Place your bets. Uh, I'm pretty. The spiffing pretty Brit chill. is invading, and we're gonna. <laughs> yeah, we gotta beat up Spiff. That's we're the gonna, plan. We're gonna, we're gonna be all right. Shout We're trying to, to make tea here. Hello to we all no the, drink tea on our island. All the Lewis and Ben fans in chat. Hello, Forsty Reckon. Good to see you. Good to see everyone. Magic House, hello. Um, cool, cool, cool. Right. Um, so I'm just happy to be choose, anyone, really. I don't want to be one of the start ones. Button. I've been them a lot. Um, when you when you want to when you want to do it. Pick. Oh, how do you how do you, how do you so pick? just click on you choose spirit, spirit next to it? And oh, that button. It will take right, the card right, right, right. and it will move it over to your starting okay. zone. I'll be the shadows that flick. Oh no, he's low complexity. I want to be like a medium complexity boy. Um, uh, thunder, thunder, thunder speaker. Thunder speaker. Yeah, 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 I'll be the thunder speaker. Ally of the Dahan. Sure. Sure. So I, I, my skill is using the local, local natives to help them fight back. Yeah, yeah. you're, you're, you're chum. You're a native chum. Maybe you're like a oh, shaman. Oh no, I think they're my chumps. Oh. Oh. I'm XCOM commander. Ooh. And they, they can run in with the high X. What are you going to pick, Dessos? I was going to let you go first. Well, I, 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 I was either going to pick the, these guys or these guys. If you picked a tree, I was going to pick wolves. And if you was going to pick wolves, I'll pick a tree. I'm actually between these two right here. So All right. if you want to be wolves, I'll be a tree. Okay, I'll be I'll be the, the sharp fangs behind the leaves. I don't know what they do, but we're going to find out. A spread of rampant green. Oh, for some reason. I'm a shrub. Some, for some reason, there's a gap between us, but that's fine. Um, oh, that's because I, I wanted to be blue. So I oh, blue chair. and so you... Right. So there's just like a random empty chair. There's like a yellow guy there that's, or something like that. That's aesthetically unpleasing. I should be over <laughs> one to the right. <laughs> that's going to trigger a lot of people in chat. It's fine. It's fine. I'm the wolves. I'm sort of apart from you guys anyway. I'm kind of doing my own thing. I think. So you've got to start a card. Um, it's got, got special rules spells. on it. So for mine, for example, my presence may move with beasts. Whenever a beast moves from one of your lands to another land, I may bring my presence. I am mm -hmm. one with the beasts, the cat boys. Cool. So I need to place a presence and a beast in my starting board in the highest numbered jungle and then put another presence in a land of my choice with a beast anywhere on the island. Okay, so Where does my starting presence go? Because I can't look at the If back you of the hold card. down Alt and then hold down Shift, it lets you look at the back of the card. Ah, okay. It's yeah. a peak. Pro uh, skills. A little peak about. So about... which board are we? Are you like? Are we like A B C for for boards? Um, uh, a, well, it depends. Look at your setup really quick. Because I have to put mine in the highest wetland. But yours is in the highest wetland on your board. Okay. 
I'll be on the it's right the, over here. Oh, yeah, actually, it's A, it's A, B, and D. So Daltos can be D for Daltos, B for Ben. Oops. An and A for L. Lewis. A, A for, uh, yeah, L. Lewis. Uh, his full name. He doesn't like want you to know. Sure. Uh, <laughs> highest number jungle. So here, I guess. And then one wetland. with a beast somewhere else. So I guess I'll go as far away as possible. Should I chum up with you? Are you? Can we be friends already? That's a, that's kind of weird. Oh, maybe oh, you could be friends. We're supposed we're all, to work we're all on the same team, guys. Yeah. We're, all, we're all spirits together. Yeah, there's elements of there's elements of beast spirits on on that side, and there's elements of beast spirits on this side. Um, and I'll put my beast here. That's what's going because if I put mine in the highest number of wetland, then that's not here. That's like here, here, and I won't be on my side. Oh no, it's the highest numbered wetland in your tile. Gotcha. Yeah. Um. So you've got you're in the jungle, are you in the wetland? Ooh. And Ben, you're in the desert in the mountains. Yeah. The shamans, well, I go where my that's people where go. That's where the man. people go. Yeah. I go I where guess. the people go. They they kind of hide in the deserts and the mountains because the the horrible invaders they've take been, all the good yeah, lands. They've had to flee from their homes because look, this city has made all this poo. So if yes, we get too much poo, there's, poo, already, we lose the game. there's already Ooh. three poo on the island. Uh, if we get six more poo, poo, we lose the game. We lose the poo poo. Oh no! Um, don't we flip the flip the poo card? Oh yeah, over sorry. And the this this the, yeah. the, 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 the the island becomes blighted. Uh, but mm. don't worry about that. That would be bad it's if food. that happens. So we do need to keep track of the poo. Uh, also, the idea really is to drive away the invaders. We win by making the invaders scared enough to run mm -hmm. away from the island by completing fear. We get fear mm -hmm. by killing them <laughs> or mm -hmm. making yeah. them afraid in some other way. Or just spooking them. And um, as the, as we go along with fear cards, we can win by getting rid of every um, city or town. Yeah. I think the victory, Terra, one, Terra level one is if we can kill we every kill single everything. invader, we win. But, but as if we the fear enough, gets unlocked, then eventually it's just destroy towns or just destroy cities. Yeah, the victory points will change. So it'll be... And we might be able to get them to go away if we do destroy all of their infrastructure and there's just a couple of little cities left, or big cities left. All right. Hmm. So you start with four cards down. in your hand. These are your powers. Um, you actually, on your turn, can spend cards, but they cost energy. So this costs one energy. Uh, I'd play it out like this. Um, but once they've been used, they go in your discard pile. And this is all you get, right? And so sometimes you're going to have to spend your go, the start of your go, reclaiming your cards from your discard mm. pile. For me, this actually costs an energy to redraw my hand. Um, oh, wow. Yeah, it's pretty bad. And I get one That's energy rough. per turn by default. Um, at, uh, but I can, when I grow, I can pick to get three energy. So I can fairly easily get energy if I, if I decide to. Anyway, I think mm. we can probably just start. Shall we just start? Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. Do we want to take it, do it in turns? Is there anything complicated we need to do? I, 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 we need to do the first um, explore phase. Oh, yes, we do. So um, so we get the top. Oh, is that one card or two? Did I put, yeah. So that's one card. Cool. My internet went hey. low. Sorry, guys. It's see all if good. I can see if I can get that rehosted for you. Blood Rage looks cool. Blood Rage? Yeah, I'm looking at the top 100 list for the different board games. Oh, wow. Look at that. That just went, that went real bad. Blood Rage? Where did you see that? Uh, go to boardgamegeek.com and then browse all their board games. It's number 29. No, number 32 overall. Do 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 do
doodly sorry about that. Do 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 do. Let's see if I can get you guys back in. That was that was our it, office internet. Our office internet has been really funny lately. I wonder if yeah. there's like a thunderstorm going on. Ooh. Sorry about that disconnect, guys. Did you guys, did you guys miss much? What did um, you, how far did you get? Ben was just flipping over the first explore. Phase. I was flipping over the first first explorer and it got stuck because because I died because um, you weren't there and you were host. Yes, yeah, sorry, sorry. All right, okay. So everyone. Is everyone back? I'm, not in yet. I'm just waiting for everyone to get back because they might have had to refresh the the stream. Blood Rage is pretty good. I always think of it as a lighter version of Chaos in the Old World, says Nysosis. Oh. What is? I never really liked Chaos in the Old World. It was like a, an old fantasy flight game about being like the Chaos Gods in Warhammer. Oh, that's awesome. But because it had a, it had a fixed setting and each god played completely different, it ended up being like this weird thing that was like Nurgle Red always wins Nurgle unless the player who is corn from a beats up Nurgle really turn. hard. Um, there was and no so lines it was like, of play. So there was lines of play, yeah. It was like, oh, well, the corn player didn't stop Nurgle from winning, so Nurgle won. Or, uh, you know, stuff like that. Yeah. Um, so I got, I think it was really fun the first like two or three times I played it. But then once you see those like options, then like 10 minutes into the game, you can sort of see what's going to happen. Yeah. Um... There's a bunch of really good board games. I'm really into them at the moment, and I feel like this is a great opportunity to just learn them because there's so many cool. The digital, it's much easier to learn these board games digitally than I think than than with all the counters. Just because, you know, reading like it's a, I mean, if we didn't know what we were doing, setting this board up would take us like half. An oh hour. god, yeah. Holy First crap. time I played this game, it took took me a long time. Right. Anyway, let's. It looks like everything's fairly stable. So, let's try again. Sand. Mm -hmm. So the the explorers will start off um, attacking all the the sand locations yeah. next as long as to it's adjacent to a coast or a town. Yeah. So there's one. There's one. There's one. They go in the ones that already have a town. And oh, how are you doing one. that? I'm pressing That's numpad one. Oh, oh fuck. That's Num handy. Numpad one. Yeah, it says down here that. in the bottom. Like pro move, and it also just, it also has got a little icon. Uh, it makes them red if I'm the one who touched them last. You see, uh -huh. so you so know like, who who fucked around with it. Yeah, uh -huh. and people are like Daltos, stop adding extra men. Yeah, I exactly. never. So I'm like, these to hand are important. This blight we need to deal with. Look at these blights, and they're all red now. I've clicked on them. The poops need to be cleaned up. Clean up your poops, <laughs> and you Clean walk your doggos. Poop. And this poop, this poop, too yes. much poop. Poop, do, 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 poop. So uh, these explorers have explored, and if we don't mm -hmm. deal with them, next turn, yeah. they will go ahead and build, build. towns. Everywhere there's yeah. an explorer, they will build a town. Yeah. Now, we don't have a lot of time to deal with that because a lot of our spells are what are called slow speed. So all of these mm -hmm. that I have here, apart from this one, uh, are slow. They've got a little turtle on their icon. And that means they don't happen until after this a next another explore and another build has happened mm. and so we kind of have to accept that these explorers here are very likely to just be able to build towns so yeah. sometimes you won't want to cast a spell because it might be like kill an explorer but if it's slow speed it won't be an explorer there it'll be an explorer and a town um mm, but sometimes yeah. you want to cast a, a town like you're like send oh, beasts shit. to where we saw that explorer because there'll probably be a town there now so then we can eat yeah. it yeah Remember um, the first time you played it, I was the lightning guy and I kept giving people fast casts. We're not going to have that. this time. Yeah, you really got to plan ahead now. It's, yeah. um, that guy's a real crutch. You get used to him real quick. I love that guy. Oh, um, am I in the wrong seat? Hang on. I think I am. There we go. I sat in the wrong, sat in the wrong seat, there. dudes. Oops. That's what happens. Oh, it dumped my hand onto the table. Okay, that's fine. Right. Um, sorry. So, so then I guess we can start. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so let's all plan out our moves and then I guess we just go down the line and say who's doing what once we've all made up our yeah. minds. Yeah. Um, so I can. My options for growth are I can pick two of these, get my cards back. Don't really need to do that on turn one. Add a presence. So adding presence is good because it reveals these little icons. Now, these little icons let you cast spells. 
Um, mm. For me, mine are, for example, um, if I imagine I'd cast a spell like this one, and um, that already has little icons on the side of little chili peppers and a forest. And if I'm revealing mm. more chili peppers and forests, I can actually, if I've got enough, um, it'll say how many I've got up here. I can cast these innate powers. And this one, for example, lets me cast a quick spell within a range one of one of my presences on a land that isn't blighted. And I can bring wolves there. And if I can get it even higher leveled up, I can make the wolves eat stuff. Um, yeah. And then I can push the wolves as well. I can eat stuff and then push them away. Uh, or I could do a slow frenzied assault uh, at night time, I guess. And uh, that will cause fear and damage but it will injure my own wolves which i kind of want to not do um so yeah otherwise taking these things off the board lets you get more energy per turn um or it lets you play more cards per turn uh, and in the case of my later ones i get to reclaim um cards so if i if i get it all unlocked i can then get five play five cards per turn and reclaim two Five seems, cards. Seems optimistic Ooh, to be yeah, able that's to, a play, long way off, though, to right? play five yeah. cards per turn. Um, and I might never get there. Uh, so I guess I definitely want to play a presence out. And I probably want to just get three energy so I can play some, some of my cards on turn okay. one. Ooh, there's a little ready button. Boop. Are you are you ready to go? I'm a ready steady I boy. Before. Yeah. Um I'm not sure if that matters if in the scripting or not. Flip those. Oh no! Actually, maybe. Oh, maybe I'm not ready. Oh no! Oh, you're right. <laughs> oh no! Oh, just seen something else. Is uh, there's a thing that's fast? I didn't know it was fast. Add a presence mm -hmm. to a jungle or a land with beasts. Sure. Let's go and put a presence over here on this land with beasts. Um, because I can. Boop. And get three energy. Okay, so that's my growth. And then I need to figure out what I'm going to play. I think. Um, well, unfortunately, this is quite a slow spell. It's going to destroy a. It's going to destroy a, um, an explorer, but that's not much useful. Oh my gosh! Terrifying chase. I can push two explorers or towns or the hands. Um, and push two per doggo, and if I push any invaders. To fear. Wow, I could harry them across the land. Yeah. So yeah. Them all in one place, that could work. I guess it pushes so them. Building half as much. Like, you want to get them out, like this guy here. He's going to build a town on the poo. So we yeah. need to get rid of him. Cause well, if unfortunately, make... all of these are slow, Ben, so I can't really do much. Oh, okay. I can't, all slow, I can't actually do anything. Just doesn't I, matter. I can push their towns once they've, once they've built them. So I might do that. Um, but I can only push them out of a land that I have a presence in. So um, I can push them out of here or out of here, but there aren't any in there. Hmm. Terrifying Chase, not that useful right now. Maybe I should put this in a forest instead, but there aren't any enemies in forests either. And this is a city, and I can't push cities. I can only push. I can only push towns. I can make them move. Hmm. Did the Dahan do damage first, or did the... Uh, oh, the Peoples um, do damage first. So the Dahan, if you don't defend the Dahan, they just get slaughtered and don't really fight back. Yeah, because I was going to push a whole bunch of Dahan into this area, but they're just all going to get slaughtered. All right, that's well, I, I've got defense spells. I can defend Dahan. Uh, do you have presence over there? Uh, where do you want to do it? I was going to try, I have a spell that pushes three to Han, so I was going to push these oh, two Oh, no, that's good. Here. Getting them all in one place is good, because they're much stronger together than they are spread out. Yeah, but do you want to um, do something with that? Not this turn, but next turn I can, because I can. I could spread my influence more that way next turn. So I'll and save then... that for next turn, because they'll get slaughtered if I move them all over here. Right, that's four damage. They won't, um, they won't be um, attacking this turn. Well, that's Remember, right, they... they're only exploring, yeah. Yeah, they're really exploring right now. We have to wait till they try to ravage. That's ravage. So, so basically, now, we, what happens is next turn they'll build, and then next turn they'll ravage, and they'll come and explore a different place, and build on a different place, and ravage a different place as well, which is all all terrible. We did, we definitely don't want all of these things happening. But um, there's not a lot we can do, uh, so I think we're just gonna play it by ear uh, for now. Can't even do that. I'm gonna do a two near the jungle, and I'm gonna do a. 
Uh, teeth gleam from darkness. Okay. It's going to be my so starting. Everyone, everyone decided on their moves? Starting plays. We're ready to Still go. thinking. Hang on. I just have to. I think it's going to be this one. Out of presence. Um, I'm just not sure if I want to do damage or anything. Does anyone want an extra presence? Um, I mean, I'd, I'd never say no to an extra presence. Powers me up. Yeah, All I'll presences are very good. Yeah, we need presences. Yeah. Okay, I'm sure. ready. Why have okay. I got two presences here? So I'm not sure what you did with those. That might be um, a bug from the reload. Yeah. Oh, right. But yeah. Um, have you put your presences down, Ben? Yeah, you put your additional one down, right? Let's start. Let's start. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so I, put, I started with two. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, and then I put an extra one down because I chose this one. Yeah. Cool. All right. So you can only pick one of them. You picked out of presence and gained four energy. Yeah. Cool. And Delta, she picked it all. Picked some other stuff. I picked an out of presence and plus one card play this turn. Okay. Cool. So I actually picked um, put a presence down and gain energy. The reason I put a presence on this mountain was because first of all, this beast there, but also I figured they're going to explore in one of these areas next turn. And if I, and because this is a slow action, it will hopefully get rid of, get rid of one of them. Um, that's the plan. Oh, but maybe not. Maybe it doesn't work like that. I'll figure it out. I also have to get, I also have to pick up a minor, uh, sorry, a power card because I picked the gain one energy and gain a power card. So I get to look at the top four minor powers. And yeah, pick you one. get to look at four, pick one, and the rest go in the discard. Yeah. So there's actually a slow one. I can grab Lure of the Unknown. Ooh, I can grab someone out of the... I can gather someone into one of my lands. Or I can give someone a minor power. Wow, I can give you guys powers. That seems like a powerful Ooh. card to have. Ooh. Give you more cards. Target spirit gains a minor power. Does that mean you get to pick which one you want as well? Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's exactly the same mechanic as what you're doing now, so it'll be draw four, pick one. Yeah, this is cool, because then we're going to just be giving each other loads of powers. I mean, Dad's already has this, like that. This, this sort of similar effect, but um, yeah, I can do. play that. can play that next turn. Cool. I don't have that effect. I can just give you presents. I can't give you powers. Well, I feel like also, if I'm going to get start getting to lots of actions, I can play lots of actions, but not very many expensive ones, and I feel like a cheap, free power giver Mm -hmm. Feels like a winner for me. All right, so okay, let's anyone do it. got any fast actions? First of all, me, 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 me. What are your fast and actions? Me. Um, I'm going to do a sudden ambush. Um, I may gather a hut. Each hut in that territory deals damage to a man. All right. So I'm going to oh, grab this Dahan. hut here. Those aren't huts. Those are Dahans. Yeah, it's a um, Dahan hut. Oh, oh my God! It is. Yeah. I'm going to gather them over here. Boom. One damage. No, fuck you. You're dead. You're fuck dead. Out. Get out of here. So oh, what's also push. cool about this is if you just drop them on the side in the blue, they disappear. You don't have to try uh, them. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. yeah. In the water. So I managed to, so I sniped off that explorer before he could build his town. That was the, the plan there. But look how expensive it is. Two, you know? Yeah. yeah. Costly. But that's cheaper than, it's prevention rather than cure. Exactly. Mine you know? kills explorers, but it costs me. <laughs> cost me a fucking zero but it's unfortunately it's too slow to deal with them in a very reasonable way yeah um yeah all right dad what's your fast action so my fast action was to give a spirit a presence and it has unlimited range and you can add one presence up to one away from your current presence so whichever one of you wants it whoever thinks needs it more you take that and add um i wants, would like it please presence. go on then you, you grab it is that all right? Yeah. Yep. But you keep spreading out across the world. Uh, Unless you need the strong presence. So you could either have weak presence, which is one guy, or like Dallas has got two guys stacked here. This is a strong presence. I think I have to do it as a strong presence, don't I? No. Isn't that what the card said? Um, oh, you know, within one. Yeah. Okay, well, I'll spread over um, like here. Where Daltos is, because then I got, I'm in striking range of um, this guy. We haven't got much over this side, have we? Actually, no. Nah. We've got a good, we've got a good line through the middle and this side, but not. These are our weak points. 
Okay, so that's the fast actions. Uh, mm -hmm. I think I put this in the wrong spot. What's the rule of placing presences? Can I do it in a spot that's flight? Uh, you can, yeah, but if if a spot where you have presence ever gets blighted, then I think you lose your presence. Yeah. Um, I can I can do a fast action here. Raging hunt. I can. <laughs> <laughs> Such a raging hunt. Never been called raging that hunt. Uh, you may gather one. Um, one beast. One beast is all I can do because I don't have. But see, if I wanted to use the second one, one damage per beast, um, I would need to get another three and two. So it would have to be. It's quite a lot, um, I think. Is that how it works, Ben? I can't remember how this actually works. How does this, these innate powers what? work? So if you've got two, you can basically do this once. Is it like, does it stack? Um, do you know what I mean? Is it like two, two and then two and well, five? Weird, normally it's just like a more powerful version. And um, Yeah. Or are these three different you, abilities? You normally do everything in the list if you can afford it. It does not stack, says Imperatus. Yeah. So... Usually when people space out the contraction so yeah, you can like do, that, you I pick, listen to it. Pick one of those, I think. Goon. It's just normally they just cost more and are better. But this one's right. just all different ones. So I can push two wolves somewhere, or I can gather a wolf to me, or just to, to, to somewhere within one of me, or I can do one damage per wolf, which pulls my presence with it. Oh god, this is complicated, Ben. This is actually like quite advanced. Is it? It's moderate skill. I think the idea is that I'm supposed to be able to move. Like if I push this presence and this wolf here, I'm able to like move together. You see yeah, what I mean? that's it. But you got to be real careful not to move your presence to where they're gonna like mess it up and kill everything. Yeah, but I kind of also want to be able to like use this terrifying chase next turn. So I think I'm gonna push my wolf here and I'm gonna move my presence with it into this territory. Because um, there'll be a town here next turn, and I'll be able to terrifyingly chase those guys away. Oh, cool. Or will I? Or will or will they ravage first and kill me? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, this is dangerous. <laughs> yep. Oh gonna... yeah, you can't do it to blighted tiles. The target land can't be blighted. Oh, I can't even move there. God, this is actually way more complicated than it's I. A lot of restrictions. <laughs> Uh, you get used to it. Yeah. I will... Uh, I will... I will... Uh, I'll do nothing. I'll do nothing. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't need to gather, really. I don't need to push. I don't need to move. I think we'll just stay where we are. It's fine. Okay. We'll worry about it next turn. All right. Um, oh, you can click these buttons to draw stuff out. Ah, useful. Thank you, chat. What? Overboard game says you can actually just click this button here next to the minor and major powers, oh, okay. and it will let you learn one straight away. Um, All right. Okay. So anyway, Ooh. now we do the let's do the invasion. So, well, I wasn't done. I wasn't done with my turn yet. You oh, you still got fast oh. actions. Yeah, and oh no, slow actions. Never mind. I, I bet. I bet. Okay. So now it's there. Go. So, so they're yeah. gonna build. So they explore uh, first, and... right? They explore first in the mountains, then. Yeah. Uh, do you, oh, I, I, I always did it the other way. Okay, sure. I think it's supposed Spoiler to be mountains. in this order. I could be wrong. Um, tell me if I'm wrong, chat. Uh, so what, they explore here? Ten gifts of some magic casts. They explore... Oh, magic casts. Very generous. Thank you, dude. Yeah. They explore here. And here. And here. Basically in every mountain. And here. Okay. Sure. Explore every, right, in, every they, in every single. Then they build um, in the desert. So we got a town here. Oh no, they've already got a town here. Sorry. So uh, how do I delete that? Delete. Well, we're going to use drag it. Oh no! That, yeah, turns there into, you go. that turns into a city now because they already yeah. had a town there. Oof. Um, they build here. They build here and here. That's why I think pushing these the Han here might be a slaughter. Unless you think you can we defend can hold them, though, up. right? Yeah, sort of. Well, maybe we just get them out then. So they I built be... four cities, four towns and a city. It's okay. a big build. Um, so that's that. And then, is there an event card? When does the event have? I guess at the start of the next turn. Um, 
And also, what? How does England work? Uh, uh, level one. So when the card comes, there'll be a card that comes out um, of the explore deck with a, like a symbol on it. When that right. symbol comes, we do the thing. Okay, the stage two escalation. Uh, on each board yeah. with towns and cities, build in the land with the most towns and cities. Oh, they send loads more colon colony colony people. Oh, and by the way, if there are ever seven or more towns and cities in a single land, they win instantly. There's an additional loss condition. So if any of these oh, places wow. get really out of control, we just lose. Okay. No no Gigatropolis allowed on Spirit Island. All right. So slow actions now. Um, oh, chat says we were doing that in reverse. It is meant to be um, Ravage, Build, then Explore. Okay. Well, I've, I've been doing that wrong. Thank you, chat. Uh, that's good to know. Uh, so um, then we'll do slow actions. I'll start. Two near the jungle, generate a fear, and destroy and explore it. So I'll do it to this one, which is next to here, yep. and kill this explorer. Nice. He won't be building. Um, nope. So that goes in my bin, and that generates one fear, so we click to add... F add. F oh, that's not right. Um, generate fear. Oh, this is this is buggy. Uh, okay, hang on. Oh, hang on. We're meant to start with um, 12. Yeah. Oh, we're already on twelve fear. Okay. This well, it's twelve. We have to, we we have twelve in the pool, and we have to fill up. Yeah, we have to move it down, but 12. it's not actually working. It's just all bit bit fucky. Um, yeah. Oh no, here we go. Look. Oh. How about we just um? How about we just use the? I think top we'll just here. count down twelve. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, we we'll just count down. Fine. Okay. So every time we get a fear, we count down one. Okay. And every single time you destroy a town or a city, you get a fear or two fear, respectively. All right. Yeah, a town is one fear. The other one is two. Uh, teeth gleam from darkness. Um, do a fear. Add a. Um, add a wolf. If target land Ooh. has both uh, wolf and invaders, three fear. Ooh. So. I suppose I can do that on... I have to do that one from a jungle in which I have a presence. So I suppose I could have done that um, to this mountain before I defeated the explorer there. See what I mean? Oh, yeah, you could cast it in the, other, in the other order, yeah. So that way it would have generated a fear and added a, a wolf boy mm -hmm. into in this area. And in fact, cool. it would have generated three fears because there's. Well, it's one or the other. Oh. Or... You, either, you either get a fear and a wolf, or if there's already a wolf there, you get three fear. I'll do. I'll just do. I'll just do the fear and the wolf. That's. Uh, I'll just do it in the order I did it, and not cheat. How about we stop? We we don't cheat. Let's not cheat. Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay. That's my go. Done. Ooh. Cool. Um... Uh, so mine's mine's pretty easy. It's just uh, get a fear, and each Dahan deals damage. Equal to my uh, presence. So, That's quite um, an expensive spell, that. Yeah. yeah, I forgot. I should have. Oh, I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. When you gave me the extra presence, I should have I should have doubled up presence. Um, Each Dahan deals damage equal to the number of presence in your target land. So, two damage. Yeah. No, one. One damage. I've only got one presence. Yeah, but each Dahan. So, one damage, one damage. Yeah, so two in total. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, I would have done four if I'd had double presence. Okay, well, that's fine. I'll kill a town, and killing a town generates a fear. Nice. Yeah, so, so explorers have one life, towns have two life, cities have three life. So that's two fear total. Nice. All right. Uh, strategy question. Do you think it's better to move these two to Han here or move this town here? Because if I move this town here, it's going to kill Dahan, but it's going to off... The Han back. And well, they're not attacking. Um, they're not attacking jungles anytime soon. Yeah, um, so you can safely move it. I mean, you've got a you've got a defense spell, and I've got a defense spell, right? Yeah, so, so, um, so between us, we here. could super protect. We could get four to Han here, give them loads of defense, so none of them die, and then they'll counterattack and gut this city. Yeah, my other defense. I don't have defense spell. Two other defense spells. My other two are mostly add presence fear or do damage. But you've got like I an innate. You've got this one here. Um, uh, I don't have enough 
Did I be, like so this plan icon that got yeah. shown right here? Does that count towards the two plan icon? Yeah, you can add them all together. So you, you with this turn, you would have had three plants and a and a water. And defend two. So yeah, so you, you I can get do all that of next these turn, icons. I think too. If you can do that next turn, I can cast a defend three. So we'll have defend five between us. So defend right. when they, they ravage the is like a like a shield, like a damage shield. So what will happen in the ravage phase, which is going to happen imminently, uh, or not imminently, it will happen during the next turn, um, is that these guys will attack the equivalent of their damage. So it will be three, six. four, five, six damage. That will do damage to both the land and and the, the hands yeah. in it. Mm -hmm. But if we defend five between us... There'll only be one damage left over, and one damage isn't enough to damage the land or kill a Dahan. Yeah. Then um, we counterattack for two damage per Dahan, so they'll take eight damage. And wipe and that all out. Wipe so out. It, yeah. basically, if you didn't put any shields in here, they would cause a blight and mm -hmm. kill three of the tanks. The Dan Herney have two life. But if you put That's a shield right. there, all of the Dahan will survive and then fight back for two damage each and kill everything in there. So if you can keep the Dahan alive, they're very potent. Uh, defense but by doing this we are ignoring all of the other shit that's going wrong on the map um but oh, you can't at... deal with everything so you just got to pick your battles you have to pick and choose we brought up a good point i'm not sure if you're aware for each to hunt killed by invaders ravaging a land destroy one of your presence within one space that's the thunder speaker trait so just yeah. gotta be aware. all right mm -hmm. yeah all right for each to hunt killed by invaders ravaging destroy your one of your presence <gasps> But only within one. So if I'm nowhere near it, it doesn't affect me. Yeah, but you are near it. We did yeah. the Ravage build explore in the wrong order? How did we do yeah, that? Yeah, but it didn't make any difference. Apparently you're supposed we to go Ravage the towns build explore, explore, not explore, explore build it's... Ravage. Okay. I guess it's because... Yeah, that does make way... Of course that makes sense. Sorry. It, it, yeah. The reason is, is because you might get... You might build a town yeah. that they can then explore out you of. Might, it's the wrong order. Mm. Yeah. Um, okay. so it is it, we should be doing it the right way around, but in this instance, doing it the wrong way around made no difference. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we, we'd be giving ourselves a massive disadvantage over board games if we did it the wrong way around. Yeah. We're, it's the inverse of cheating. Um, <laughs> it's like just making the game impossible. If we were doing it the wrong way around, I think we'd just lose instantly. Uh, all right, are you guys done? Mm -hmm. um, yep. Is that all your slow oh, actions? Actually, no, I can move. I can gather. Um, I've got slow gather ability. I can move two huts. Um, and oh, I can do the other one as well. I've got two orange and a yellow, so I can do um, destroy a town for every two huts in target land. Oh, wow. So I can, um, I can break this town here. Yeah, go for it. I'll stop that ravaging. Um, um, and then get a fear for that. Oh man, is that too pretty strong? Pretty strong. Oh no, no. I'm sorry, I'm cheating. That's too, I needed two yellow and an orange, and I've got one yellow and two orange. I got it the wrong way around. Um, yeah. Oh. I, and I I forgot to do this with my slow. I'm doing one damage to this town, right? Uh, okay, one damage isn't enough to kill a town though, and then it just heals up at the end of the yeah. town. You can get an explorer oh, okay. with it. I thought it, you turn it on its side when it gets one damage. You do, but then at the end of the turn, anything that's damaged gets ah. It's just so that if you've got another ability that deals one damage, they can like combo up as long as you cast them in the same turn. Yeah. After all. Um, so I can just gather gather two guys. So oh, we God. will... I guess we'll have to evacuate this place. Because it's going to ravage and kill yeah. the oppressors. They're going to they're gonna get killed. Um, flee and that'll do sure um, I don't have enough stuff to do any of mine and I already missed the job to do before so okay so I think is that it we're done okay so round two I think we have to draw an event card right Ben uh, yeah yeah um, Rising interest in the island. Ooh. Mm. The, the British Empire has published a pamphlet. Come to Spirit Island. Your island is unlike any of the invaders have seen. Their leaders begin to take interest in the tales of strangeness. You may either ignore the curiosity, return the top card of the invader deck to the box, 
Skip cards specially placed during setup. Right. Oh. What is what is that? The invader deck is that that's oh. the exploring deck, right? Yeah, I guess so. Then uh, we have to add towns everywhere. But on each board, add a town to a land without one. Oh, Ooh, God. oh no, that's, that's really awful. bad. That's that's pretty bad. So okay, we won't do that. Um, or weave lies in the minds of their observers. Cost four energy per player, aided by a, an aubergine. So that means we can use we can we can um, we have to pay four energy per player, but for every purple we generated, we can reduce that cost by one. Return the top fear card to the box during the next normal ravage. Each town or city does plus one damage. So do we have to pay that now? I've never used this before. If we don't do the ignore the curiosity, right? Yeah, let me find out the timing on when the events are drawn. I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah, because we clearly don't have jungle. enough energy to pay that. We need 12 nah. energy. What's the uh, Beast of the Jungle traps and snares mean? Oh, here we go. So the uh, aided by element, you've got a lot of choices. You can gain four cost towards the cost by um, discarding a spell with that element. You can gain two towards the cost um, by um, discarding it from your hand. Right. Into your discard pile. Or you can gain one towards it for every element you have in play. So if you come over here, there's like a little card that shows you. Uh, oh, right. Okay. What that means. Okay, for, uh, it means you for forgetting a power card with the element from hand play or mm -hmm. discard. Wow. I don't think I have any of those anyway. I don't have any aubergines. Look at these tokens. Anyway. Look at the card right to the right of it. These tokens are new in the expansion. We'll explain this in a second. They're very easy. Yeah, they're really quite straightforward. Um, yeah. Plus one towards cost for each of that element you haven't played, which is none. So I can't help with this at all. I can't. I can't do. I can't even add any energy. I don't have any. I've got zero energy. Oh man, well, I think we're going to have to pick the other one, unless I want to chuck a load of my cards. I guess Cause I've got loads of purple, so I could try and solo it. I suppose. Uh... Um. Well, I guess these are in the bin, Run so energy. each one of these you do is four. Well, I don't want to permanently forget them. Um, no. But, but I've already got... I will be able to give you another, a brand new one next turn, and every turn. That's um, true, but these are like my, um, my like, starter cards that work really well yeah. for me. You know what I mean? They're, like, pretty bad. You only have plus four here because you don't really want to get rid of everything. I don't think you have any aubergines either, as well, do you? No. So you can't help either. So the only person who can actually even contribute is Ben. When do we do oh, this bit? right I now? Can, the most I can get is like six. So I, I can't solo it without. So we need twelve energy. Entire hand. Total. But we have to do it. We have to do it immediately. Well, I guess we're putting towns everywhere, right? Oh um, God, we might as well concede. Yeah, I, I think that. we have to. This feels yeah. like a like a game over card. One, two, like, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, look, ten. We get, 11, we get help 12, with uh, 13, traps 14, and snares and beasts of the jungle towns. if this happens. Yeah, we add we add um, on each board. We add a wilderness, and we also add uh, three beasts and some fear. Yeah, we we get some help. I don't know, Ben. I think it is. I think rather than four, is fourteen towns worth, you know, some of your cards going in the bin? Uh, it, it's me losing all of my cards. For your first turn, it is recommended only to do the bottom half. Otherwise, it's super swingy. Who's saying that? The person in chat that seems to know what they're talking about. <laughs> Imperitas. Yeah. Is this what it says? Um, is this what it says in the rules? The event rules. Sure, it's like probably one of those like unspoken rules. This feels crippling because no one's got that kind of cash at the start of the game, so you're right. always going to put a town everywhere, which is like a real, a real brutal one. He says it's recommended by the designer. Ah, all right, sure. And it will be a real role in the next expansion. I mean, it helps us, so I'm <laughs> tempted to believe them. 
Because yeah. I feel like putting a town on every place or me losing all my cards feels like a real, uh, real savage start to the game. Uh, yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I feel like the game's hard enough without this deck ruining it for us. Um, fine, we'll do what chat says because neither of those choices seem pretty fun. Uh, and I don't really want to just flat out restart the game. So, fortunately, this isn't um, this isn't the, the digital oh, version. We we're misreading it. It says add one town to a land without one, but only once for each part of the board. So we'd only be putting three towns down, not like 20 towns. Yeah. Maybe that's not so bad. And plus, I mean, look at traps and snares. We get all these snares everywhere, and we get the those, uh, these mm. tokens everywhere. It's only three it's towns, not 14. Not as crippling as I thought. Okay. No, that's actually fine. Um, sure, let's just add one town to each board there in that case. Fine. Uh, like we can we can stick like one over here. Where we've already got Tahan ready to like nom it. Um Daltos, where do you want the one on your board to go? Um I guess this wetland or this mountain over here. Maybe this blighted mountain. Right, Not already, mountains, gonna, they're going to be. They're going to build there in a minute. Yeah, so maybe this wetland, right? Yeah. Boop. Okay. And then one... Got, got towns. And then one each here, board gets maybe? a beast. We'll put... To a jungle without blight. So one fear of invaders are present. So we'll on my other... board, I'll stick one there. So we get a fear. Okay. Spooky beasts. I'll stick mine here, so we get another fear. Nice. Oh, does the city count? Yeah, yeah. Any, any okay. city, town, or man counts as like invaders. Okay. And then, Lewis, did you add one here, or is there already one here? There's already one there. Okay, um, so you, I guess you can put one down here. Uh, yeah. Okay, and then. Cool. And then each board add a wilderness there. to somewhere with a Dahan. Cool. Uh, and, and then the, what? Add a wilderness, wilderness to each land. Yeah, so that wilderness means that it blocks an explore action in yeah. in an area. So I guess we probably want to go for like jungles which haven't or wetlands which haven't come up yet. Yeah. So take, take your bets. Uh, I don't have any Dahan there. Oh yeah, I don't have any darn here either. I've got one. There we go. Maybe in this blight? In this mountain? Yeah, I mean, we've already had an, we just had an explore there. Uh, so I just don't know where to put one. this. Because there's no um, other Dahan anywhere. Maybe here. Yeah, you, bet you don't have a lot of choice. Yeah, maybe the jungle. More likely to come up. I think we'll put one here. Right in the middle. Hopefully we'll have to deal with this one boy at some point and just try and push them to the edges. Uh, the, the, the one the thing we need to do really is when we're pushing people around, it's trying to... Unfortunately, because we've got those three extra towns, we've sort of removed our capacity to get on top of the spread. Um, mm -hmm. They're pretty much going to just go in every single zone. But if we can clear like a few areas out completely, then mm -hmm. a lot less of them will spawn, especially in the centre. Um, yeah. That's what we want to try and do, but we might not be able to do it. So let's just see how it goes. All right, okay. That was rough. Oof. I did not enjoy okay, that particularly. Go over here. No. New turn, yeah? New turn. Good luck. I might mm. actually get some fucking energy this turn. <laughs> Jeez. Um, right, so Dautos, remember, we, you've got you've to try and get the defense on turn, as do I. Yeah, I don't really have... I told you before I didn't have a lot of defense cards. No, but you've got it here over here. You're innate. Dana. I don't have a lot of defense. Like, as in, when I play these cards out, I'm only going to have enough to defend. So. Oh, yeah, we just need one. Yeah, I just need the defense two to stack with my defense. and that. Oh, that's yeah. It. Yeah, that was happening anyway, so. Cool. All right, so I could do with getting... Three beasts and two forest. So the gift of power works nicely with me. Oh no, it's not. It's not got a beast on it though. I'm gonna do it anyway. Terrifying chase. Push some people out of my lands. Get out of my lands. 
What's the leaf here? Three energy. I think I get this. I can sure. Get can I gather? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's. In that case. So what I'll do is I'm gonna gather this. I'm gonna gather this wolf. Well, this is what I'm planning on doing anyway. I'll gather this wolf into here and I'll push terrifyingly them all out of the mountains into this wetland here, and uh, that'll that'll get rid of them. That will get rid of them out because they're going to build a town in here. At least I can like push them, push them away from this mm. this bit. We had sand first. I guess it will happen after the ravage, so I suppose I can push them into the. Oh shit! This town looks bad. They're going to ravage the sand here. Oh shit! Where well, there's already blight, can we stop that? Because blight on blight is double bad. Because, yeah, if they've already got a blight when they do it, they will do another blight there. I don't know if I, I can have only it. do slow damage to kill that. Anything that's fast enough. Yeah, I don't have anything fast. Oh, shit. I can't do anything about it at all. Shit. I can add a blight there and fear him, but that's it. Or I can add a presence there and fear him, but that's it. Well, I can add a presence there. They attack. Oh, no, that's still just... No, hold on. You can, you've got a thing, right? You can do your... Um, uh, if you have double presence, then you can prevent... Um, yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah. Can you so get double presence? I can't. I, well, I could have put double pre. No, I can't. That, that's retconning, and it's also cheating if I double presence. <laughs> okay. That's a double whammy. Well, let's, let's not cheat. <laughs> uh. During each spirit phase, you may place one of your um, one of your presence with a beast. Presence moves with beasts. Damage per beast. Gather gather a beast. Damage one damage per beast. I need a lot of beasts. I need yeah. a lot of beasts. You got a lot of beasts. It's like there's four on your bit all alone. Yeah, you but need they to only do. Them. They need to be together. Yeah. They need to, they need to, they're on their own. They're weak, but together, Ben, they're strong. Together, Dahan is strong. Mm. Yeah, target land has beasts. Invaders do not build there this turn. All right, so they're building in this mountain as well, which is already blighted as well, which is a bit of a problem. Um, I have to have a presence there. Stop them building. I need to move. I need to move there. Oh god, this is this. I shouldn't have picked the. I shouldn't have picked the wolves. It's so complicated. <laughs> oh, no. it's so complicated because the wolves they move around with the presences and you can swap out your presences for wolves but I'm not sure I'm not sure I've, it's too complicated for me I'm like my brain because this game's already pretty complicated with like you have to like think okay first they're going to do this but you've all, I, I can't deal with any of this like you, the problem is the board you're looking at is not the board you've got to think a turn ahead the whole time the board is actually there's a town here you and think there's, yeah. a there's a town here, yeah. and this is and there's, there's actually the three right. blight here, and like yeah. you're like okay, this is this is frustrating because you're looking at the board thinking like how do I I need to be able to see into the future, Ben. We're so slow <laughs> to act. Um, oh, sorry, dude. We, maybe we should have one of us should have been the been the lightning guy. That's all right. We'll we'll have to figure it out. Um, I got I got the plans for me if that helps. Okay. Uh, this is fast, so I can. I can play. I can just zap this explorer, and then I don't have to worry about him being pushed. I don't have to terrifyingly chase him. So that's all right. I can just zap him with fast. So he's not going to build. Where do I need to? Where do we really need to help out? And where can I go? I can go. 
presence with jungle or land with beasts within three away. Um, presence with jungle or land with beasts within three away. I guess I, go, I guess I can go here. Okay, well, you overthink. I'll tell chat what my plan is. Over here. Pretty straightforward. Over here, me and Deltos are going to combo protect the Dahan, and we're going to slaughter them. Combo. Combo. We're going to, like, Eiffel Tower over the top of, like, the the, the colonizers. Yeah, and the colonizers is going to be the in-between part. The strut <laughs> holds up them. And then um, over here, I can then move all these to Han, like somewhere else to go, like mess up one of these towns over here. Yeah. And I'm going to use my innate power to like smash this town up in the jungle with my with my Dahan up here. I'm oh, all wow. about Dahans. But we're going to get some blight over here, which you can't avoid, and we're going to get some blight over here, which we can't really avoid either. Really awkward. This. Maybe I go. Maybe I go here. Just, just see what happens. Um. Sure. Okay. Fine. We're doing. We're doing this. This is what we're doing. It's terrible, but that's what we're doing, and we're actually going to move. This to here. This is how. This is how we roll. Oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> oh bloody hell. Okay, everyone everyone locked in? We decided? Yep. Cool. Who's got fast stuff? I do. Do a fast thing. Overgrowing a night, I added a resource right here. Cool. Doesn't um, get a special terror thing, but I wanted double resources. I'm trying to build double resources. Yeah, okay, you go. Your, your tokens down. That's cool. Uh, and you've I, got your I did it. all enveloping green, right? Yep, defend so two. Can, so you can right put this here. this poor bad boy down. Okay, oh, cool. Perfect. Is that your Just marker? Uh, my fast stuff will be only one, and it's the same thing, marker in the same place. Eiffel Tower, blam. Yeah. Sorry, I'm not following you guys at all. So you did overgrow in a night. Oh, what did you Double, no, double you... stack. You did overgrow in a night. That's us. Mm -hmm. so got an extra presence down. Yep, and and all enveloping green, which is my racial. To ability. defend four or two? You defend two. two. Okay. And then and defend... I've it with my card here. Defend uh, three. Words of warning, defend three. Okay. And that's all the fast stuff we've got. So what you can do is there is a token actually is here, which you can use, which you can just set to say five. Oops, put in the C. Uh -huh. But we can just set this instead to say this is defended five. Uh, to remind us, because it makes makes it easier sure. than, than having these random fucking things here, which are not okay. particularly helpful. Um, what have you got that's fast? I've got nothing that's fast, so... Okay, so then it's there go. Um, let's yes. do it in the right order. Yeah, let's get all these up. Oh, whoops, wrong. Okay, so uh, ravage the desert. How do I do a blight? I'm bad for. So, Blight here. Blamo. Uh, this explorer gets himself killed by the Dahan trying to exploit them. Yeah. He's um, like a missionary. <laughs> yeah. He's coming to them telling them, have you tried tea? It's delicious. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. <laughs> That's the sacred leaf. Chop him up. Uh, then they're going to Blight over here. Um, boom. Oh dear. Um, they're gonna they're gonna try and blight it down here, but as we've already established, the defense five soaks it all up, and they are all brutally murdered. And we generate um, one, two, three fear from that. From city that and town. Fucking... Yeah. So towns are one and cities are them. two. Or That's thought... right. Yeah. Or towns mm -hmm. are two and cities three. I can't remember. But yeah. Well, it's they towns have two hit points and cities have three hit points. But they generate one and two fear. Right. Yeah, okay. it says right below the fear thing. All right. Um, then we get a blight um, in the desert, which also, because there's already blight there, generates another blight. 
um, where do we want to put it? The mountain. Mountain. Although yeah. they're they about to build there too. I'm going to get rid of that though. You're going to get rid of them. Okay, cool. There it goes then. And that is all the deserts done. Cool. And then we have um, two right. blight left. Oh god. Okay. Spooky. Right now they're going to build in the mountains. So this mountain's clear. That's good. Yeah. Um, this mountain's not clear. Boom. There it goes. This mountain's not clear. They get a town. This mountain, not clear, gets a town. This mountain, not clear, gets a town. This mountain, not clear, gets a town. We just got to herd the Dahan. Just mm. keep herding them and throwing them in spots. Get them on the little path. Yeah. Okay. And then lastly, they're going to explore the water. So um, this wild token prevents the explore, but goes away. Useful. Um, it was uh, it was here, and then uh, they go here, and here, and here, and Oops. here, and here. Press cool. F. Press F to, that, to be sad. That's their go done. Yep. Yeah. Flip. And then we get an event. Oh, we get an event. Oh God. Um, war touches the Isles' shores. Invaders from a different faraway land assault the ones here, torching farms and bombarding cities. You may allow these attacks. So let's assume like the Spanish are, are fighting the English. God um, bless them. God bless the Spanish. <laughs> uh, for each board, discard the top major power. Uh, deal its energy damage to the invaders in a coastal land with the most buildings. Wow. Okay. Or or we can help repel the newcomers for a cost of one energy per player and add a fear card to the top of the fear deck. There's a bunch of what is that? coastal land bastions. I mean, look at here, here, and here. Why would we ever want a new fear card? Well, but the fear card is how we win. We don't want to add cards to the fear deck. That would just make it harder for us to win. I think it means flip a fear card. Oh like, yeah, we've maybe earned. Not. Maybe we earn them. Does it mean get a new one off the stack? Because there's some more. Yeah, that... that's terrible. Why would we ever want to do that? Because there's twenty more fear cards here. Do we do we add it to yeah. make it harder for ourselves? Maybe or... fear fear cards do good stuff. So if you add fear to it, maybe you get more bonuses. Oh, chats um, saying it will blight the land that you don't defend. So it will. The, bomb, the damage will happen to the cities, but also the land underneath the cities. Oh, I see. Ah. So they'll blow up some towns, but we'll get blighted. If it does, well... If, if it does two or more damage, we'll get yeah. blighted. Uh, where would they strike? are quite expensive. Yeah, so they're probably going to, almost certainly going to do damage. Um, so this megatropolis here would get hit in the, in the mountains. Yep. Here, um, here, here. It's the top one on each board, isn't it? Do they only take one place per board? Uh, yeah. Coastal tile with the most on each board. Yeah, so once in each, in each board. Oh, God. Is it worth getting three blight to like probably blow away three cities? Well, we get the island will be blighted. That's true. We will be blighted then. Won't be a healthy island no more. But if we don't blow up these cities, they're going to generate blight anyway. But if we're... But once the island's blighted, Ben, it's only a matter of time before we lose because it really the, it starts punishing you really hard. It's like you lose a you lose a presence every turn, <laughs> like um, or, or worse. Like it's it's bad. It's bad to be blighted. We don't want to. We don't want our island to be blighted. We need to save the island. Yeah. Mm, yeah, but the cities the cities will blight us. Yeah. Have we even got enough energy costs to do this? I've got one. I've got zero. Oh, so we can't even afford this. We have to. We have to let them fight. We don't have the resources yeah. to manage to. I spent all my energy. Yeah. Shit. Okay. Well, let's draw a major power. Bam. Okay. Here we go. This one is accelerated oh rot. God. Four damage. Okay. So that blows up the city and the explorer. Yep. Does that get? Does um, that give us the fear for that? Yeah, two fear. Take that. It gives us a fear card, and puts us back on twelve. Uh, twelve. Okay. 
But okay. the spirit card now, or do we wait? Just this, gets, blight down this gets blighted. So press four. There we go. Bad. Amazing. Second okay. major power is attacking this coast. Yeah. Right here. It is the three. three. Pent up calamity. Boom. But also a blight. Blight. Ah, mm. Jesus. Unpaired it makes four. sense, right? Because they're fighting. Blight container is now empty. Uh, island is blighted. So let's hit this one in the wetlands rather than the one in the mountains. Downward cause... spiral. Uh, we got the yeah, 15 sorry, blight here. If okay. uh, any blight removed from the board returns here, if they're at the start of each invader phase, each spirit destroys one of their presents. Yeah. Oof. Okay. It's rough. It's easy for me. My my presence getting destroyed is fine. Sure. Um. Right. Okay. And then one more major power for the the wetlands. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. So that's where we are now. And then this last major power is, bam, power storm. Power storm. Three damage. Blows okay, up to kill the city. Yeah. Or. Destroy these two. Oh God, the island. Oh, no. goodbye. And the blight. Dude, okay, so we took three blight, but we did destroy three cities. So you know, mixed bag. Yeah, pretty bad. Pretty bag. Okay. And so now each on each island, we can push an animal, and if they go to where invaders are, they generate fear. Ooh. Um, so let's do that. Let's. I'll push my one into the mountains and generate a fear. Mm. Uh, where do you want to move yours, Deltos? I'm going to push mine into the wetlands. Generate a fear. Cool. And then Lewis's one's probably more important because you can your presence can move with them, right? Yeah. Uh, where do we need to go? We need to go into the wetlands, probably. Um. Yeah, because that's I have to go into an unblighted land. So this one's like you're only. Option really. Oof. Sure, we'll move here. Into this, into this wetland. See if we can deal with these guys. And then, lastly, each player may push a uh, Dahan into an adjacent land, doing one damage there. Pretty uh, cool. Um, sure. Or the turns are down. Each, does it have to be in their land? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to stick mine over here, Delta. Uh, I was going to stick mine there too. That's fine. Oh, okay. No, you can do that. If you like. I was going to move this Dahan over here, and that way it'd be closer to these two Dahan. Yeah, we'll bunch them up. Okay, cool. Kill that explorer. Go to the ocean. Yeah, um, let's push a Dahan into here and kill this explorer. Yeah, any lone explorer is really worth picking off because, you know, then that's just one less thing to worry about. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Cool. All right, now the slow powers. Okay, who wants some minor power? Um, I, I think I, I think I will take one. Um, okay. Because I need another <laughs> who wants card this in thing? My I do. <laughs> well, yeah. All right, it's yours. What do you like with it? Wasps. I think I think it's got to be wasps, right? Oh, you so, got it. Yeah. That's that's on brand for you. Sure. They're wasps, basically bees. Wasps it is. And then um, push two invaders, towns, or to harm. Uh, if you push any invaders, make two fear. So I think I need to push these invaders out of here. Because they would, they would um, build there otherwise. Mm. Yeah, anywhere otherwise. we're going to build next turn. And I feel Can like we need, to, we need to protect these, mount these places with blight in. Even though this already is a disaster, it's better than putting mm. it into the wetlands, which is going to just end up building ravaging in there. So, yeah, this is where it's going. All right, so that was that. Uh, get to fear. So that's not too bad. Um, bam, bam. And that's my. That's all of my goes. You'll go, Ben. Okay, I get to push four, four to Hans. I'm going to push these ones here, into here. Make the Giga stack. Giga stack. Oh my God, Giga we need to hand stack that. Is. 
Remember, you can also move presents along with your giga stacks. Do you have to push them all that way? Well, I have to push four. Well, I don't have to, but I can push up to four. And it feels a bit silly to leave some behind there. I mean, can you well, push them different ways? Back this way. No, I, I, I target a place and I push people to that place. So they all have to go to this. No, 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 push. you don't. That's gather. So you, when you push, you choose the territory you're pushing from and then you push them where you want. With gather, oh. you choose the territory where you want them to be gathered to and you suck them to there. So you don't okay. have to move them all into one mega stack. Especially if you think it's just a waste. Okay, cool. Well, I'll, I guess I'll just push one in there. That's enough. If I defend these guys, they'll clean up. And then I can chuck two more. Um, Either in this wetlands or in this desert. I mean, they're going to ravage here. Or over well, here. Remember. Or over here, yeah. Yeah, but I can only defend one of them. Well, but Doubtless can defend this one, can't he? I, yeah, I can defend this one right here. Yeah, if Doubtless promises to defend one of them, and I'll defend the other one, then we'll, we'll clean both those boys up. Uh, if that's three you pushed, do you want to move this one as well? No, I pushed them. Um... Oh, yeah, no, I need one there and two there. Yes, I've got, actually got one left I can move. Um... I don't know where to send it. Start stacking them up over here. For the big yeah, push. Maybe we start. We start. Get, yeah. I guess we can try try and push them to hands into there as well from these other yeah, places. Anytime we get a chance, let's try and make a fortress there. Yeah, or bring down some. Maybe we need a major power to, you know, sort that place out. Uh, and that generates two fear. All right. Uh, Did we oh, ever right, flip this fear card, by the way, that we earned? Uh, we flip it next invaders phase. Okay. I think. Um, but I've also got my lead the furious assault, um, in eight power down here. Um, I can destroy one building for every two huts. So my plan was to get rid oh, of this wow. one. Oh, wow. Ah. Snipe it off, and then there's no nothing it's happening. Amazing. Yeah, except for these two over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm, working. I'm on it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, that gets us another fear card. So they get flipped then, over uh, at the start of next, at the start of um, next turn. Yeah. Um, well, they happen just before the invaders phase, I believe. Let me check the reference. Guys, um, such an odd, odd thing is because you got the fast powers. And then yeah, all powers, the invader then... shit happens, and the card goes Wait. off, and then we do the rest of our powers from last turn, and I then we get a new turn where we have wrong. to decide what's wrong. What are we doing? We're not cascading the blight. We can't have two blights on the same space. Yes, we can. No, we did cascade the blight. We stuck it. Um, we got down two blight. We got what one additional one on here, and one on an additional tile. Okay. It doesn't go yeah, here like right? this. Doing... Yeah, you get. If if you if you have to blight someone that's already been blighted, the blight goes. You get an additional blight, which is why we ended up um, getting fucked. Yeah, it spread real fast because of that. Yeah, we did cascade it correctly, guys. You just create an additional which cascades the top of that. All right, cool. You can. Uh, uh, right. Lastly, I can move. Um, I can move two two huts. So, um, hmm. I guess I'll start trying to. What did I do last turn? I think I think I didn't. I think I should have got an additional power card as well last turn because I did the one energy, one power card. So I think I'm due another minor power, um, which I will do now. Uh. They just didn't remove Lewis's presence in the mountain. That's the only thing they did wrong with the oh. wipe. Oh, yeah, when, over here. Oh, yeah. When did this come down? Uh, and if we lose all our presence, no, no, we'll lose the game. Did, like... Oh. Okay, so we're okay. That's, that still works, right? I think. That still destroys me. I when it move. cascaded from the sands, it's supposed to destroy your, your presence. Was the force to reckons. I don't know. Maybe I we like should put it here better. instead. Then I don't really want to yeah, lose presence yeah. if I can avoid it. Instead, because we can pick where it goes, can't we? So. I forgot that blight destroys presence. That's relevant. There you to go. Me. All right, we problem. fixed it. We're fixing it. Please do do correct us all, all these mistakes. Oh, I, I do want to know. Yeah. 
Uh, right, do you have any last, like, slow innate powers or anything? Or should we start next turn? My slow power didn't matter at all. It was one damage to both. Oh, uh, yeah. And I use my innate. Cool. All right. Uh... Next turn. Woo! Right, I've got to reclaim my cards because um, I used all my cards now. Which means I'm going to be a poor, poor man with no energy. I'm going to absorb corruption. This is my goal. Ah. <sighs> Right. Um, and I get two powers. That's fun for Ben. Um, fun for Ben. Fun for Ben. Let's learn a minor. Um, what are the options? I'm gonna go. Oh, gonna... defend five. I'm gonna get. <gasps> I'm gonna get. My presence here. So I'm gonna take right. add a presence yeah. to a jungle and gain three energy this time. Here. Because every so far I've been taking the power cards every turn, but mm -hmm. now I feel like it's time to stop taking power cards. I've got seven powers. <laughs> That's a lot of powers. I can start doing other stuff. Um, so I'm going to play this here, and I'm going to use Absorb Corruption slowly to suck that power away, um, which is excellent. I'm also going to okay, do I'm some taking... wasps. Um, picking a uh, defense power. For my second power. Da -da -da -da. Wasps. And this one, because I might as well play them all out, see if I can get something happening. I should have. Oh shit, I don't have enough green. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. Well, who's happening this time? What are we doing? We're ravaging um, the. Does anyone need a lot of energy? Turn, like a ridiculous amount of energy? I don't have anything expensive, but more more power is more good. So I have this get the loving energy, and that's actually really good for supporting people. Um, but I'm thinking about getting a major power next turn. Maybe. How do you get the major power again? You, Whenever you get the chance to pick a new power, you can choose for it to be major, but you have to permanently forget one of your other cards Ooh. to do it. Mm. Ravaging the mountains. Alright, so I have got a turn to deal with this wetland situation. Yeah, because they've, they've done the ravaging of the sands now. They're going to ravage the mountains instead. Next turn, I build in the water. I'm going to build in the water. Yeah, I can make them stop build. I can make them not build in the water. So that'll stop them building in the water. This will add some... So add some more wasps to that land, and then this will remove corruption. And then next turn, I can attack them with this. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I know this is so tough. It's tough. It's tough. I've got a plan though. I've got. I feel like I've. I've got something to do now, so it's not the worst. Mm. Um. What about, oh, shit, when do we have to lose our presence? At the start of the invader phase. Okay, I've got to remember to do that. Oh, yeah. Good remembering. So um, I, can, I can push three to Han again. I can give someone more presence again if someone needs that. I mean, that's great because that gives us more abilities in the long run. Oh, yeah, I right. could do with that right now, actually. That would be really helpful. But, yeah, yeah, if I'll you could um, play that on you. Oh, shit. I do need that. You can, can only add the plum. presence. Yeah, you can only add the presence one away. Should I push Ben? Can you one do anything away. if I start pushing? Where where can you push? Um what I can, can you push? push. It's a slow action. I can push anywhere near my presence. Anywhere near what, the but what can you push? Like push them, push us? I can oh I can push uh Dahan. Oh okay. or, or I can push a town. Into the Han. Ooh. Oh, like I can um, either push this town over here into the East of Han and save that wetland from building up. They're yeah, ravaging but, the mountains this turn, right? Yeah, but if you're doing sl a slow spell, then yeah, um, yeah do that one because then he won't ravage the wetlands, and I can do the do another jungle party and kill him. Right. So that's my turn. 
and I get to defend again. All right, I think I, again, I know what I want to do. Are you guys, are you guys ready to go? I'm ready to go. All right. Okay, so fast um, actions. Hold on. Oh, sorry, hang on. Give me a sec. Um... Sorry, there's a lot of planning. I'm kind of not playing with you guys at all. You guys are like just on your own, and I'm like, I'm like chewing glue in the corner and playing with my cat. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> chewing glue, sniffing glue. Yeah, chewing glue. That's what people say. It's a tough old game. This very complicated. Uh... Yeah, it's tricky. Where can you defend? What's the range on that? Range one. Oh no! So you, you're defending here, right? This is another thing. I really don't. I feel like this is a big part of this game. Like the the, the range thing always gets you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, just when you've come up with a plan, you suddenly realize you realize. Oh, I can't use swarming wasps away. in there because it can't target yeah. lands that are blighted, or it's range one instead of range zero or whatever you know it's like oh shit i have to actually do this on a land that i have a presence in yeah well somewhere's gonna get killed unfortunately gonna get more more blighting because i can't i can't defend um Right, fast actions. Okay. Doubt okay. us, you can start. I give you uh, presence. Okay, I'm putting it, it in here, bit. in this desert, for some reason. There you go. And then I also defend two right here. Okay, and nice. Um, so get, oh. uh, get a little counter defending two. Um, nice. Okay, cool. Is that your fast? Is that everything? Yep. All right, I will... Uh, add some swarming wasps to this land here. Wasps. Bam. We love wasps. Okay. And then I will uh, also gather to me one more beast. If target land has beast, invaders do not build there this turn. But it doesn't mm. actually matter. Because before they can do that, I'm going to do... going to eat them all. Um, um, One um, damage per beast. Um, raging ranging hunt. Nice. And that eats this explorer and this town. Three damage. Amazing. So we get one fear generated. We threw Gwyneth Paltrow in there. Okay, that was good news, everyone. Thank you. I'm pleased about that. That used up all of my shit. And then that is my f whole go. Uh, so that is job done. Uh, then it's your any more fast stuff anyone fast anything that cost me two energy that was it yeah i can stick a defend uh, down that cost me one I energy i don't know which place is best to put it i guess and this cost me one energy yeah just to stop blight um cool. are you gonna do defend here well there's three places i need defending i can only defend one of them so okay. um i'm gonna go with the one that's already got blight oh right okay cool yeah. oh dear um that's fine yeah, it's, bad. it's real bad but this one's too far away from down here is too far away from my presence can't do anything well rip um so now we do our fear cards yes um so the first one is gain defend one in all lands Ooh, that's very good okay I like that um and defend three in all coastal lands oh wow so here 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 we didn't even have to do this so this is oh, actually yeah. a defend oh man board. we really I get confused by this. this isn't coastal shit this isn't coastal. yeah i just got confused by that oh yeah let's so here okay. here here but this is oh this is annoying yeah that was turned out to be unnecessary for us oh well um, could have could have saved here instead so that's four so this is the only one that matters i guess well everywhere gets to defend one is that going to help at all? No, because they've got three everywhere. Yeah, it's irrelevant. It's actually both these fear cards uh, do nothing. Both those fear cards didn't help at all, even though they sounded amazing. That's a shame. Okay, no, that's that's bad, but that's fine. Uh, um, so we ravage the mountains. Yeah. Uh, so start, should we start with up here? Yeah, so that one's safe. Um, Just gets protected, but doesn't fix it. That one gets blighted, and I lose my token. Um, then this one gets protected um, over here 
and um, Fights we kill all their guys. Gain a fear for that. That's good. Um, this one down here uh, loses a Dahan gets and blighted. gets blighted. This Dahan um, gets injured, but, but I think can still fight back. And kills that town. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Gain a fear. And then there's no one in the other mountains. So that's that. Uh, then they build in the water. So um, they're going to build a city here. Yeah. Um, and is that the only water territory? No, they're going to build a city here as well. And then all the other waters are empty. Okay. And then they're going to explore the deserts again. So that is uh, this one. One. We oh, try to explore here, but the wilds get in the way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, Glad I put that down. Here. Yeah. Yeah. So it doesn't really make a difference to explore everywhere anyway. Yeah. Okay. Uh, um, event card. Event. Oh no, we lose a presence first to take a presence off. Yeah. God, I'm running out of presence actually. Do we all lose a presence? Yeah, everyone yeah, loses a presence. Yeah, because blighted an island. Mm, you're right. We'll just stack them up here, Daltos, in the, in the river. Well, the only thing is I can reuse my destroyed presence. Oh, so. yeah, Daltos can bring his back. Even so, I think you can leave it here um, until you need it. Um, okay, right. Now we've got um, a wave of reconnaissance. When exploring, add an additional explorer to each land explored. Whew. Okay. Um, but raiders, sorry, invaders do not ravage lands that have disease or strife. Okay. Which is not, we don't have any strife on the board, do we? Or and only disease. a tiny bit of disease. Yeah, we've got some disease here. Oh, there's here. a few bits of disease. Okay. And oh, then God. on each board, push to Dahan from a land with a city to a land without a city as they retreat. Um, right. So, do we have any Dahans in cities? Only here. Uh, these aren't cities; these are towns. Oh, you're right. I don't only think we do. Here then. Oh yeah. Do you want to go here then, with the two and the uh, two? Sure. Two Dahans better than one. Yeah. Twice the fun. Right. So what was that's the other thing we stuff. had to do? Add an additional one to each land explored. Do we have to do that now? All right, so everything, right, so it. the sand all gets an extra explorer, right? right. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. There we go. Cool. I need to get presents there, and I need to start poisoning people. Good lord. Okay, now we got our slow stuff. Yeah, I can pay an energy to remove a blight. So I'm going to do that. Amazing. You'll go. I used up my one energy that I had left. Okay, can you go you first? Go first? You're going to move something, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, I was going to push the house, town over. And then right. I can move the house. Yeah. It's mine. Here Did go, you do ben. it? Uh, right, so I'll use my um, Furious Salt to kill uh, that town that Delta's moved. Okay. Um, and I can call to Bloodshed, which is one damage per Dahan or gather three Dahan. Um, you can call it here so, if you want to kill anybody. Yeah. Or I, no, I could get. Call I could do it here. here. Yeah, I could yeah. kill this town. That stops least, them from building up a city. Um, yeah, that makes sense. All right. One damage for each Dahan, sure. Um, okay. And then I can move people around a bunch. I can gather, gather two and push two. Oh, geez, where are they hitting next turn? The wetlands. So All that right, card so kind of whiffed the good bit of it anyway. Man, these cards have not been helpful. The fear cards haven't helped us, and the 
mm. these cards have not helped and us. The events haven't helped us. Yeah, it, the fear cards were very disappointing. Those meteors were not bad. But also bad. Good but bad. Oh. Hmm. Daltos, are you able to defend again, do you think? Like if I push yeah. into the, the wetlands. I can pretty much defend every turn because I have uh all okay. my spells are water spells. If we if we defend this coast, then we can we can chew it up. Okay. Gather the warriors. Very cool. Yeah, gather the warriors. Very I cool. Like I like how we're working together between us two. Because mine's all about just shoving people places and absorb. Yeah, I've yeah, got we'll a little gang that. of wolves going around eating eating dudes now. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Now that you've got the wolves on the go, it took a while to get them together, but now they're like a little kill squad. Rawr. Little Rawr. Wolf, wolf team. Wolf team six. All right. Cool. Okay, we're ready for a new turn? Yep. Yeah. All right, sure. Um, I think we're ready. Yeah. All right. So I guess I'm guess I'm getting my hand deck of cards back. So that's this one, which I have to spend a um, energy doing. So I need to get either this energy or this energy. I guess I need to get three energy mm. and get my hand back. I don't think. What, what have I even got this fast? And they're hitting the. And they're gonna ravage the water. Use energy to do that. I also get to power gain a power energy. card, so maybe it's time to gain a major power. Let's look and see what I can do. So I can gain a major power, but that does cost me. Um, I have to discard a minor power that I no longer want. Um, what do majors look like? Because I'm concerned doing that too. Majors are pretty cool. They all cost like three to six, but they're pretty strong. Yeah, I don't have the energy for that right now. My guy is good at playing a lot of cards, but they're all low cost cards. Mm. Sweep into the sea. If target and his coast will destroy all explorers and towns. It's not really that much of a problem with that right now. I don't did that, need that. Uh... Poison just causes more blight, but we're already blighted anyway, so yeah, then again. Instead. I don't really want to do that particularly. Oh, I can't Blood even do that. Plague. Plague. Fuck. Add two disease. For each disease in target land, defend one in target and mm -hmm. all adjacent lands. Okay, let's hold I need a strong back. presence for that. I don't have strong presence. Okay, that's fast. Ooh, I have a play. Uh... It's poison land. We're taking the poison. It's poison. It's just a poison. Don't mind me doing a poison. And... Okay, I've decided. I guess getting rid of one fucking jungle asshole is not super good. And check donations. Hey, we have had we all oh, we've had a thirty dollar donation from Asterad. Thank you, you very did. much, Asterad. And they say evening commanders. Make sure to put the rookie chump Daltos through his place paces. <laughs> yeah. Also, happy Pride Month to all my friends out there. I've been rewatching Avatar the Last Airbender lately. So which element would you most like to be able to bend if you could? Oh. What kind of bender Ooh. do you want to be? Uh, you can do all sorts of weird stuff. They have like it's not just it's not just the main ones. You could be like, um, uh, like a fruit bender. You could, like bend bananas and like other fruit. <laughs> well, you could be like um, a chef. What was blood blood bender. Well, that sounds weird. Ooh. Wood wood oh, bend, wood sounds, sounds fun. Wood sounds cool. Very niche. Wood bender. You just cracking <laughs> trees. Uh, we can get all sorts. You can get trees to grow and stuff. Stop cracking my trees. Air seems like the best, though, right? Can you fly with that? I've never seen it. I've never seen it. <laughs> Avatar. I've always been told to watch it. I've but it's like it's... a thousand episodes long, yeah. which is interesting for me. I don't know. It's. It's. I guess none of us. It's not. It's not. Um. It's not one I'm familiar with. Lava. I'd be a steel bender, so I'd just be bender from Futurama. Oh, nice. That works. Yeah. I like that. 
I've All just right. found something out there, Atos, right? Like, so you know you've what? got two plant um, things on your board. Mm -hmm. If you grab, like, two plant things out of your bag, then it counts them on this tracker at the Automatically. top. Automatically, nice. So I don't have to just keep it in my head. You have to, like, sort of keep remembering or looking down. Mm. Oh, out of what bag? Uh, up here. Oh, These right. These are bags of tokens. So anything you've got on your board, you just pull out. And oh, now when you helpful. cast your spells, it will count your board. That Ooh. is very helpful. Whoever, whoever sent that in chat is a, a legend. Oh, I figured that out myself. I'm a smart boy. Um, oh. Keximus Maximus says, why not be a pitch bender? That's a good... You could be like pro baseball boy, right? Oh, yeah. Just bend those balls and just like earn the big bucks. I'm telling you. Do you have any, do you have any sons, Ben? Uh, well, I have one son. Teach him how to be a left-handed pitcher. You'll never, ever want for money or food, ever. <laughs> it's not, I don't know. In the UK? Is there much cool for that? No, you move him over to America. Send him to some sort of, like, academy. He'll hate you. Oh, okay. He'll hate you. You'll never see him again. Yeah, oh, but you'll but be a billionaire, you know, man. For, like, five years, he'll be... He'll be he won't want for work until yeah. he's too old. Although pitchers can be quite old, I imagine, right? They don't do too much running. Oh, they by the way, Ben, you and... drew this, this thing, look. The symbol. Stage two escalation. Oh yeah. Ah, no one's seen on, on each board with town cities, build in the land with the most town city. Right. Do a, basically they get a free build where they've got the most things. So on my board, this it's equal everywhere, so I can pick. Yeah. And I'll choose. Oh God, it's all awful. Um. I guess it has to be here city here oh god they're just this is like sewage central in here yeah mine turns into a city over here right yeah another city on this tile yeah oh no That's oh no terrible. you get a town because it goes no no you get a town it's only when there's more towns than cities so put that town back and then they get another town for their build all right oh whoops too much too dense. oh geez okay so we're gonna need more defense than we thought um, so they've got eight attack, <laughs> and eight in there. Oh no, defense seven, I guess. Oh, that ruins everything. Ah, England. If seven or defend... more towns or cities are ever in a single land, they win. Oh, we've got to be careful of that. Remember. Oh no! Oh god, Dartle's just in time. You've upgraded your defense to four instead yep. of two. Oh, yep. good God. I have a cool okay. play that enabled me to do it. I just like put all my presents in. Good plan. Okay, now we're all right then. We, can, we, still, we still can do this. We're on the ropes a bit here, guys, but I think if we really, really work together, we can, we can stick it to the Brits. 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 I get three cards. Can I absorb corruption? Mm, yes. I can. I have to pay an energy, which I can do. So for innate powers, you can do them all from top to bottom. Mm -hmm. That works for everybody. Yeah. So I can defend six. No, because yours actually says instead. Oh, instead. But I also have a moon and uh, yeah, you like can do the, uh, this. I can oh. do both of them, right? Yeah, because you don't actually spend them. You don't spend them, so you can do both. Yeah, you can do uh, you can do one damage twice ah. and four. Yeah, that's Can't clean up corruption. I can. How do I move all these bloody wolves? I guess I have to use these innate powers. So I have to choose which one of the ranging hunt I want to do, right? Uh, you can do all of them. If you've got... Enough. You've got the beans. Yeah, so you could push two and gather one. So you can basically move three a turn. As long as you've got... I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be back. That's all right. You've got two red animal things. I'm getting up to four red animals now as well. If I can get four red animals, I can actually cast this thing. 
where I can do two damage and remove a wolf. It feels bad, but I understand that it has, has potential. I need to start removing stuff in here before it starts before it gets back to there again. Do you know what I mean? It's already it's already gonna be it's already bad here. Oh shit me. Okay. I think I <laughs> Okay, no, this is fine. Um we know okay, no, this is fine. Wasps are fine. Gathering wolves is fine. We're bringing all the we're bringing the wolves, bringing all the boys to here. We're gonna get five boys in here and deal five damage. Ooh. And stop them building. Nice. And then next turn we'll savage them some more. Come back. Hey. <laughs> So I need three and two. I need a green. So I can do anything that costs zero. Or one. Sure, I guess we're doing this. Okay, I'm just going to start nomming all the guys in this big, big sandy area with loads of wolves. Cool. This costs all my energy every turn. I'm, God, I'm either being very, I'm either being very efficient or I'm being very inefficient. <laughs> well, your island's looking like the healthiest out of all of them, I think. You're doing all right. Maybe. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. For fast actions. All right. All right do you want to go? Yeah, fast actions. Some wasps are coming. Mm -hmm. uh, they can't go in blighted lands, but they can mm -hmm. go nearby. So let's put some wasps down here. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's, that's a fast action. Wasps. Um, two. I may gather a uh, wolf. And if target land has wolf, invaders do not build there this turn. Oh, so nice. I'm going to gather a wolf and make sure they don't build here. They're like, cool. oh, shit, we've built too much. There's wolves there now. Um, Dragging all the builders away into the dark. And then for my other fast actions, I can gather one wolf from here to this presence. Mm -hmm. I can push two wolves mm -hmm. from here to there. And then one damage per wolf. And then I can do one damage um, per um, wolf, um, um, um. which noms a city and an explorer. Um, it's good of a city. Very cool. And that's too fair. Boop, boop. <laughs> There's beasts. Yeah. The beasts have, have come from everywhere, and they're all over these towns, messing them up. That's my fast right, actions. Cool. cool. And they can't uh, build my fast will be... No um, I can gather a hut, and then each hut in that territory destroys a man. So um, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to target this hex here. We're not actually going to gather anyone, but then the two huts that are already there will kill the two guys who are there. Okay. No. No, no. There are no builds for them. Okay. Um, that's um, which one was that? That was my sudden ambush. Okay. Then I will cast an encompassing ward, targeting myself, and every territory I have presence gets to fend two this turn. Well, that's why I had this here. Okay. Sorry. That's really good. Defend um, two in every land where target spirit has presence. Cheated. Very cool, then. Yeah. That's me. That's all my fast is done. All right. I kind of cheated, but I didn't really mean to. So it works out in the end. I actually don't have double presence here. My one fast presence was to add from a range one to put a presence there. And it also adds mm -hmm. three to the fear counter. Because there's people there. Okay. Oh, okay. Did you add that already, or do you want me to do it? I just... Well, we're on five, and we have to go down to two? Or okay. on five, go up there? Okay. Cool. Any other fasts? Uh, defend four right here. Mm -hmm. I forgot to get that. Okay, nice. Uh, they are hitting for three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But the four. Yeah, is I had a defense start. two as well. So that's six. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, that's the best we could do because. Uh, that's okay. We just I lose one. They had an extra build. Oops. 
think it got dropped in the dropped in the water. Huh. That's right. The good news is I have a slow power that can wipe out stuff now. Okay. And then is that all of our fast done? Uh Yes. Okay, so we all lose a presence. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Guess I'm just gonna lose this presence here. I feel like it's not that yeah. useful. Lost mine in the jungle. Okay. I'm gonna lose mine. <laughs> An event. Here in the jungle. Um there's a strange madness among the beasts. Oh no. Beasties. They grow even wilder and more savage. You may. Let them rampage onto death. Um which means each animal kills a Dahan and then remove one animal from each board. Or guide the madness at a cost of three energy per animal. You may decide to keep on the island. Hang on, for a cost of three energy per animal, you may decide to keep on the island. Also aided by animal claws. Remove any number of animals. Each spirit may push one animal. Cost three energy per animal. You decide to keep on the island. Mm-hmm. And right. then look at the bottom text too. For and then each one you destroy. Destroys an explorer and deals two damage. Yeah. Seek Savage a safer friend. home. You can also push two Dahan from a land with one of those symbols to a land without any of those tokens. Is that so? Does that blight like the land? So I think we're going to... I don't think it blights the land. No, I don't think so. Because the other card said damage to the land. And this one doesn't say damage to the land. So basically, if we keep the walls alive, we do more damage. But we have to commit more stuff. I think we should try and do as much as we can. Because if we can keep this one here, then um, knocking out one of these towns before they fight will save our Dahan and stop the land getting yeah. wiped. And we can just remove the beast over here, too, if we do the first There's option. a lot of spare beasts we can get rid of that we're not using. Like this one here, this beast will just kill everything in that tile. Let's guide the madness. Three How many can we afford to keep? Per... Three energy per beast you decide to keep on the island. Uh, aided by red. So you've already got four red in play, and I've got one. And Daltos has got one. So between us, we've already... That's six. Six energy already covered. Which is two beast uh, two beasts. Yeah, so two we get for free, effectively. How many are and there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, we don't want to keep all of them, do we? Like, Ten? which are the actually important ones? Like, this one down here, we don't need to keep. This one up here, we don't need to keep. This one up here, we don't need to keep. I feel like I, my thing is putting these down, though. They're quite important for me. Like, like They're going to be so much damage. But a lot They're of my cards are like, put one on there. All right, fine. Um, That's nine Dahan they kill if you leave them alive. Let me chuck. How much do, can I contribute? So Plus stuff four in your hand. You can discard a card with the two. element from hand play or discard. Plus two by discarding a power card with that element. So I can get two, four. I can get four immediately for that, and then. Plus the six we've already got. I could just forget the wasps. So that's six. And oh, forgetting it adds four. Yeah, so that's four. So that's eight total. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Eight? Yeah, so I've got uh, eight. Plus the six we already have makes 14. 14. Which is enough to save. Oh, we're one off. So well, can anyone spend any real wolves. energy? No, we haven't got any real energy left. What's the alternative? Each wolf um, destroys a Dahan and we remove four. We remove three total. Yeah, lose three and kill loads of huts. Yeah, I mean, what's it going to do? It's going to kill this hut? And one of one over here. Yeah. Well, we, we can remove and this one, one and remove this one. Then the huts don't die. And we remove this one. Oh shit! I'm obviously I'm no. Obviously they they eat them. first, and then they yeah. um, then they're removed. What? It says yeah. they eat first, then they're removed. Each destroys one hut, remove one from each board. So what? I mean, Two it, fucking it, to hands. It, Who cares? I'd rather not lose literally seven or eight wolves. 
I'd rather lose two dead hands. Most of these wolves you're not using anyway. I'm getting to keep like four they're... wolves. I need all yeah. these wolves. I've been making a lot of work putting these wolves on. They're important. They move my presence around. I need them. I need all the Dahan. I've spent loads of effort moving the Dahan around. Two Dahan? <laughs> these Dahans are going to die anyway. No, but not. No, they're all going to die because if this wolf, if this wolf here lives, he'll eat a town and a man, which will save the Dahan. If we let this wolf eat a man, we will also lose another man. Oh, whoops. How do I put him back? Um, he's done by zero. Um, and this land will get blighted. If we remove this wolf, you save a Dahan, but we also save a town and a man. Basically, if this wolf stays, we kill all the invaders in this territory and don't get blighted. If this wolf dies, all of these towns stay, the land gets blighted and all the Dahan die. No, that's not right. It is right. Because the wolf kills a town and a man. Yeah, which puts their damage below our protection threshold. Because we've got defense six in that territory, and currently they've got attack of eight. So if we don't let that wolf kill enemies, they're going to kill a Dahan and blight the territory. And then in return, we're going to kill some towns, but the city will stay. Whereas if that beast does attack, then um, they go. their attack strength goes below our defense threshold, and we wipe them out and take no damage. How many are going to be left after the wolf kills this, these two? Five, right? So the wolf will kill these two. Am I wrong? Yeah. yeah. And then there's no, five I... strength and we've got six defense. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So if we... And then there's the hand kill them all. We pay the energy to let the wolf help us. But the wolf stays anyway. We could just remove a different wolf. This wolf. No, no, no. They only they only kill the invaders if we pay energy. No, they don't. Oh no, no, they don't. No, sorry, I got that wrong. Yeah, that's a completely separate state. I think sometimes when you do this, there's only like three wolves on the board. But because I've been adding a shitload of wolves to the board, there's nine wolves on the board. And so mm. it's better for us to just remove three wolves rather than remove six wolves and pay. 12 energy for the privilege of keeping three wolves or whatever do you see what i'm saying yeah you're right. in my head because my, I, my I choice here ben, is to remove no, you're everything totally right. you're totally on the right. entire I, board or i made three the mistake wolves. of thinking the savage frenzy was part of the guide the madness so I let's delete this beast them. let's delete this beast and let's delete this beast right okay but then we also lose this to han where does that to han go yeah sure that to han and this to han yeah and then... Oh, and did you kill a Dahan here Dahan. as well? Yeah. Sure. So four, four Dahan. Yeah. No. We lose four Dahan and three beasts. And then each beast destroys an explorer and a yeah. city. Mm -hmm. So that one destroys an explorer and a city. This one destroys an explorer and a city. <laughs> This oh, one destroys this more on there, city. So this is this is all dead now. So that's three yeah. cities dead straight away. Yeah, this uh... one destroys an explorer and city. So that's another explorer and another city dead. This yeah. one destroys an explorer and a city. So that's another city, town dead. Yeah. Yeah, sorry I was arguing. I misread the card. This is really good. Uh right, so we get fear card for that. And then we get we get it, it was massively effective. Mm. And we get defense six, so they don't take any damage. And then these two Dahans will kill that city. So then there will only be a town left here. Why can't I draw a fear card here? It keeps picking up the whole deck instead of one card. You just have to be quick. That is, This is it. Oh, there was only one card on top of that. Right. Yeah, so yeah. we're now at fear level two. Yeah. Cool. Oh, so we win the game if there are no towns and no cities. But yeah. the board looks pretty clear now. Well, yeah, that, yeah, we're working that on it. It was amazing. Remember, this this ramps up over here. This so I keep deck. my bees as well and all of my other shit. Uh, let's not forget they also do um, on each board push two Dahan from a land with animals, disease, or wilds to a land without any of those tokens. Push two Dahan from a land with wolves. Well, there's not many of them left. Um, <laughs> wolves deals with disease to a land without any of those. Right. So on my board, none qualify. But these two have to be moved here. So I guess we move yeah. them to there. 
Or maybe we move up sense. into these mountains. My god, your animals have just annihilated your whole board. Just like, well, yeah. this is what we want, though, because then they won't be able to explore yeah. in certain these tiles. You know, if we can oh, but clear... this is really bad. Look, these Dahan here, which we're going to fight on the wetlands, are fleeing your animals. Uh... Yeah. Oh, well. You know, what's nice, though, is your Dahan don't trigger like you're removing your presence because that wasn't killed by invaders. Those were killed by... Uh, true, yeah. yeah. That's, a, that's a silver lining. Okay. Okay, so that's that's finally done. That was um, so ridiculous. That's okay forever. That a big one. So we lost our presence. We did the card, which is kind of cool, but also incredibly laborious. And then the fear cards are in for next time, I guess. We can't get that yet. Well, it depends. When does the event trigger? Um, I think the event triggers at the start of the invader phase. So, so the fear it just effects. triggers. Oh, well, I see. Does it trigger then... before or after? I guess it must do now. Because now we're about to draw a card, right? Yeah. Fuck it. Let's do yeah, it now. Okay. So fear. we're in stage two now. Each player may choose a land with a hut or an adjacent to at least three huts. Invaders do not ravage there this turn. Ooh. Are there any war wetlands that we want to save from being ravaged? Yes. There's only two wetlands that are going to be ravaged, and yeah. it's not worth it. Both of them are protected enough to not take any damage. So it doesn't even matter. Yeah, it doesn't. It's an irrelevant card. Yeah. Help. Okay, that's fine. As all the fear cards have been, it was mediocre and disappointing. <laughs> mm. Um... Cool, so then we, we ravage the wetlands now, then. Yeah, now they ravage. We've got enough defense that they don't deal any damage, and in fact, this city over here um, is killed. Because nice. I've got defense two in my presence this turn, so he just damages a Dahan. Okay. Which heals the turn, and then they kill that. So that's two more fear for us. Did you have protection? You had... Yeah, I did a thing oh, where right. everywhere I've got a blue token gets defense two. Oh, very cool. Yeah. So that's about two more fear, the... then. Did you add that? The shit, too. Did you, add, did you add the two fear? Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. Um, excellent. So that, that's all their ravaging done. Uh, they're going to build in the deserts now. Okay. Um, means we get a town uh, here and here and here. Here. That's the city. Here. Okay. That's a city here. City. Oh, sorry. It's all right. Um, and then they're going to explore the wetlands. Okay. Right. So. Uh, which is then put one so there's one here one here one here and oh one of them doesn't actually get to spread because there's no chance the city yay yeah. more of that it's the first more of that more of that Ben. more of that please <laughs> <laughs> more of that do we do our slow actions now yes now we do all of our slow actions so i don't think i've got many i've got a fear and add a wolf on one away from a jungle where I have a presence. <laughs> so okay. fear it like here? Add a wolf to here. Sure. Yeah, let's do that. And and a fear. Boop. Alright, that's Ooh. my done. Oh, actually I could do my slow thingy. Oh, you're slow and yeah, yeah target got... frenzied assault. One fear and two damage remove a uh, wolf. So I can do it here. And oh, yeah, just kill town. that town. Well, Annoyingly, they've still like got that. enough to ravage and damage the land. But it won't kill the Dahan. It's good. And then we can, um, we can defend them or something. Yeah, sure. That's better than nothing. And it kills my beast. Okay. And that's... So that, that makes one regular fear and one fear for killing the town. Yeah. Cool. Right. Your turn, ben? I, I, we could be playing this wrong, completely wrong, guys, by the way. But I think we're playing it all right. I feel like we're pretty close. Okay, mine. Um, I've only got... I've got the Voice of Thunder, push four. Or generate two fear. Um... Mm. Where do we need to protect... Well, these two places I'm a bit spooked by because we're going to lose both. So maybe I should mush them together into one. If I push these guys into here and then defend these guys, stop the Blight Cascade yeah. and wipe them out. I like that. Okay. Um, and then this this place will just have to like wait. 
Um, so that's that. And then I've got lead the furious assault. Oh, destroy a town for every two huts. So actually... Uh, well, I guess I can just blow up the town. Then that means I don't have to defend them less. Okay. Cool. Then I can put my defense also now. Uh, I have uh, infested aquifers. If land is mountain or water, add a fear and add a blight to it. Or add a... Uh, what is this? A disease token to it. I'm going to do it right here. Nice, because disease know. prevents a build. So that, yeah. that's where they're building next turn. So I'll stop that. And I also get stem the flow of fresh water, which does one damage to uh, a town or a city, but both. It doesn't really matter. You can I'm do targeting it right here. You can just kill a, kill a town. Well, the thing is I'm doing it three times because oh. I have uh, my innate power, which one damage to a town or a city and repeat this power, which I fulfilled over here. You got three I moons. No, I got two moons and, a, and three uh, ramping. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah, you get one from the card as well. Yeah, yeah it repeats it. Uh, so this card, in combined with that, kills the city. Amazing. Very cool. And that puts us back. We get another fear card for that. Yep. Two uh, and two uh, fear on that token for that. Yeah, you're right. You already got it. Oof. This was looking real bad, but it's looking cleaner since the wolves got going. I'm pleased about yeah. that. I still think I'm playing this like an absolute noob. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I felt I was supposed to like have wolves moving around with my presence stuff. I was supposed to do all sorts of different stuff, and I just I feel like I'm I'm, I'm massively fucking this up. But I think Ben and uh, you are strong enough, and you know what you're doing, Deltos. That oh, I've been faking relief. it. <laughs> Literally, yeah. while you were figuring out that last wolf card, I went silent and started looking at Reddit and just pretending that I knew it was. Yeah, sometimes having like three or four people. Looking at one thing just makes it harder and worse. Um, okay. Amazing. So we can start a new turn now. That's that's yeah. that turn done. That was pretty pretty much a lot of wasps and okay, basically wasps the animals pulling just dudes into the bushes and crocodiles. So many and wasps is like New Hampshire coming out of the darkness. Right, I've got to redraw my hand because I spent all my cards. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think I need three energy. I get to add a presence again in the jungle or a wetland. And I think I, I get two new cards. I'm going to pick a minor power and then a major power. Oh shit, I'm supposed to be getting one energy per turn. I forgot that I'm supposed to be getting one energy per turn. I've <laughs> never managed, you. I've never used that. I've, wow. I've, wait, I've never gotten one wow. energy per turn this whole game. Three or four energy now then. <laughs> I should be, I should no, be on more energy. It. Oh, I've um, missed it. I've missed it every turn. Oh, I forgot, because I was like, oh, this is the only way to get energy. I forgot that it was one pay, one here. So got, I was about to spend this. Um, let's do the reclaim. Boy. And he lets me reclaim one from here. So I'll get more wasps, I think. Moon. I need three moon. Ooh. All these help. Although this works well. I think this is pretty cool. We'll take this. Right. We'll take Teeth Gleam from Darkness. I just right. love the I... art on this card. Which one? This one here. Um, oh, shit. Which one? Out. This one here. Oh, the Teeth crocodile Gleam. attack. Uh, <laughs> there's a red-eyed like crocodile bear. ape. <laughs> bear standing on, up on the back. It's time to go. It's like an elephant as well. It's like, can you imagine if you were like a settler and you just saw this coming out of the woods on the edge of your farm? You'd be like, oh, fuck. I'd be more terrified at the red-eyed lizard and red-eyed snake that are at the front of the, <laughs> of the pack. What do they do to get to be able to hang out with those guys? I don't fucking know. Yikes. Um, sure, so where are they building this turn? So they're gonna... They're gonna... Oh, they're gonna... I can remove a ton of blight with these cards. Pretty awesome. I don't know or how much I we've missed. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Um, so how does that? So I don't want to put my token in the jungle within three. It might have to go. Does anyone care about Blight right now? Is Blight screwing over anyone? 
No, I Blight's mean, okay. Blight's always a problem, but I don't think there's any Giga Blight going on. Mm. Uh, oh no, over here. Can you um? That one's about to turn into Giga Blight. All right. So I'm I'm concerned just drawing. All like... oh, right. Yeah. Just look at cycles of time and tide, or growth through sacrifice. Both remove blight. They both seem pretty good. Quicken the earth struggle is also pretty good. Defend ten. This is a really hard do you choice. Do have like any way of giving energy? I do. I could do that this turn for you too. Oh, that'd be amazing. Because then I can do like a drop pod attack. Ooh, drop pod. All right, let's do this. I'm going to take this one because it's synergetic. Um, oh, maybe, no, no, I can wait till next turn, actually. Do you not want the drop pod? Because I can just drop um, pod. Well, I just think like I've already got four Dahan in a place where they need to be. So drop podding them is not going to be super helpful. Right. I'll move them around and create like another little drop pod group and do it next turn. Sacrifice. Uh. So I'm going to drop some wasps here and kill this explorer with mm -hmm. them uh, in the quick phase. So those this explorer is going to be like, fuck, this island that's just got here. He's like, fuck, this island's full of disease, <laughs> blight of wasps. <laughs> I'm leaving. Oh, there and is. He's going to leave. Um, and then I need to play... I suppose I could play the minor, give someone a power. I should probably play the absorb corruption as well. Just need to have throw. Oh no, I need three. I have to. Use, I have to do this to get the three angry, three angry dogs. And then I'll get this one next turn, so then I can start playing four cards a turn. Three waters. Okay. Seven damage. Mm. This is really tough. This play I'm doing right here. I have to think this. Mm. Three, okay. one, two, three. I'm ready. I'm yeah. Play this, this. I'm ready to. I think I'm ready. Okay. Go for it. Okay, so. Fast actions. Bees coming down here. Mm -hmm. And then they're going to eat this explorer. Job done. Yay, not uh, the bees. So that's from my one damage per bee there, which is excellent. And then I can mm -hmm. push bees, push my dudes, or gather wolves to areas that are not blighted. So I can push from areas that aren't blighted or gather two areas that are not blighted. So I can gather one guy to here, and then I can push one push guy. Them. Uh, to here so I'm just sort of footprinting my way through <laughs> the map uh, that is my fast actions done so that's over to you guys what have you got fast um, Ben my fast is just um, defend two everywhere I've got presence okay that makes um, sense um, my fast action is anyone may add a presence they anyone want it uh, uh, yes, please. I want it a lot. Um, where do I want it? Uh, where's real... Where's ravaging? Uh, the deserts. Uh, I've already got, got wetlands. Presence. Wetlands next, I guess. Can't uh, place bees on blight. So maybe like here, Ben. Oh, he's he's gonna die. It's not being ravaged yet. He's gonna build now. No, the disease will stop him building. Oh, you're right. You're right. Um... Uh, 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 sure. Let's just stick it over here. Okay. Cool. There's all. This is your. I'm just making your protection tokens lol. Okay. <laughs> and then, is that your fast? Everything fast you've done? Yeah. Deltos fast. Uh, that was one fast, and then overgrow and night. I get to add a presence anywhere, and if there's invaders there, then they get three feet. And I think you might as well take the last one off your board, right? Oh yeah, that's what I was doing for. Um, I think 
Oh, actually, Lewis, um, you know your bees? Yeah. Um, they can't go in the blight. Oh, you're right. But they yeah. can go over here. Um, because if you kill a guy there, then suddenly when, when I'm not going to get blighted, because at the moment they've got four attack and I've only got two defense. Um, so I'm going to get blighted and lose a presence. But if you be them, then now they're not going to blight us. Sure, we'll put an explorer pack here then. Um, and he's not going to build anyway. The disease will stop him. Well, I can actually do. Yeah. I can actually kill two two dudes. So I can actually kill the. Oh yeah, because you've got two, two beasts. Amazing. This and then we get fit. It's even better. Ah, uh, where do I place this fucking presence? Thank you for thank you, chat. Sorry, God, Put so annoying. Here. The bees, the yeah. bees, the oh, blight the restrictions. Bees. This is good to have in Twitch chat to correct us on all these rules, because otherwise yeah. it would be YouTube right. comments being like, yeah. uh, at 2 hours and 54, <laughs> Lewis spawned the bees on a place where you can't have bees. And I'll be like, oh shit, yeah, I did. I hate, do you know, I really hate doing that wrong, but it happens so much. There's a lot of things to consider. It's easy oh wait, to... I had the wrong. I, I see it as well, though. Like, I'm watching some guys play a ball game anything. on That's stream right. or online. I see someone like, and I'm like, I've done that rules thing wrong. And but you don't make a comment because you have more. Sometimes I do. do. Oh, you don't <laughs> so have more important. Counts. He's got fifty alt accounts for like commenting and not voting with comment. I like how these look like Smarties. <laughs> yeah, they look delicious. Do you know I'm what I mean? Hungry. I'd eat these. <laughs> Sucks to have to keep okay. taking them off. Um, Is that the fast action done? That's all our fast stuff done, right? All right. So then we get an uh, events card, yeah. and we no, we lo then we lose a blight, uh, a presence. So everyone take a presence off. Sad. Oh my God, this presence Feels sad, man. Horrible. Um, so feels keep that feels sad. This one. Man, uh, yikes! More smarties on the smarty pile. Uh, um, did we get the fear card? Let me get the fear, fear card. Says, each town destroys an explorer, and each city destroys two explorers. Each town destroys an explorer. This is fantastic news. Yeah. Yeah, this is scapegoats. But there isn't oh, any. Not many. There's one here. Okay, yep. yep. This guy gets eaten. This guy gets eaten. This guy gets eaten. And that's it. Two yeah, explorers. Oh, that's that was disappointing. That sounded like it could have been amazing, and it was rubbish. <laughs> yeah. Those two get blamed. They're the scapegoats. Today. And then we get an event. Well prepared explorers. For the rest of this turn, explorers have plus one health. Oh, well, no. it's on a healthy land. We're on a blight. Oh, we're land. on a blighted land. Oh shit! Blight spreads. So this doesn't happen on that. Um, so they don't get plus one health. On each board, either destroy two presents or add a blight to a land adjacent with blight. You may choose this, even if there's no valid land. Oh shit! So then you have to. We got to take the blight, Spread right? Blight. We got to take. Yeah, the blight. yeah and I yeah. and I can easily start curing blight now that I have my cool. comp. Adjacent to a blighted land, I'll put one on these mountains. Okay. Um, where do I want to put mine? I guess somewhere over here. Sure. No, oh, here. I'll do. Fuck it, help! <laughs> Don't put it in a presence area because it'll kill it but i can defend my presence areas no but putting a blight down um, destroys a presence oh i see what you mean right yeah. my presence that's right I mean, like sorry. what do you do i forgot don't put it in here that'll destroy a presence um oh i just did the same mistake you can put it um i can always lose a presence i don't really care where can we put it i get them back put it right here on the screen all right Call that presence i'll just put it back somewhere all right fucking okay hell. Is that done? Yep, I guess so. All right, beasts prowl. Beast, each beast generates one fear if invaders are present, and then moves to an adjacent land if not. Each beast oh. generates uh, fear if invaders are present and moves any. to an adjacent oh, land if not. To. And then the other three can move. Yeah, that would be nice. And, and they can move too. So we've got three fear, one, two, three, and then everyone else moves. Rawr! Uh, so he generates a fear. Oh yeah, I didn't see him. Nice. Hold on. And this guy up here moves. Rawr! I like moving them towards 
It's, it feels like I'm supposed to move them towards cities and towns. That feels like intuitive now. Yeah. And originally I was scared that they'd get killed by the townspeople, but no, townspeople get feels... very scared and fucked up by beasts. It seems. Yeah, to be. beasts are way yeah. stronger than Han. Oh, uh, now look at uh, coming of age on each board. Add one to Han to an inland land with the Han. Hey, new Dahans. Okay, that's cool. Each um, add one Dahan to an inland land with Dahan. So we get three new Dahan villages. Oh, uh, okay. There, there's one here. Cool. Inland is not on the coast. Yeah. Yeah. You might not always have one for two, me. Uh, Which board? Um, it says board right here, right? You can add one right here. Yeah, you can yeah, add one there. Yeah. And you can add one here. Yeah. That's okay. It. Oh, hold on. Let's. Oh, yeah, no. That's cool. Amazing. That okay. is cool. Okay. Uh, that's really good, that one. That was actually. That was helpful. That was really helpful. Right. Now they attack. The deserts are under attack. Oh, so now. Over here. Da, 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 two, da, 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 one attack. Da, da, da. So we're safe, and then they all get nommed. Yeah, so they do two to the Dahan, two to the Lamb, but, but they've only got one, so it doesn't kill it. It just damages the Dahan and does one to the Lamb, which is enough to blight it. And Perfect. then the Dahan fight back. Great job. And over here, nothing happens here because two attack, two defense. Yep. Safe. Um, over here, same again. They die. Okay, we don't. Two attack, two defense. Go. That's irrelevant. Um, this is off. This is but, and here's the bad, the bad. That's the Giga. So they just blight here twice. Yeah. yeah. So, and I'll start clearing that blade, I guess. I guess the only place we can put it is here. Boop. Which and then you both kill present. my presence. Oh, no, hold on. Stop. Um, Daltos can do his special thing here. Yeah, I, just, I destroy one. And Get rid of one, and then it stops the blight from happening and saves Lewis's blight. Oh. I'm losing more presence than I think I should be losing. Well, okay, we're losing one too, uh, No, I know. I'm being too risque with them. I'm just throwing them away. I'm like, yeah, let's throw that one away. Get you, back. you can regrow it, right? Yeah, I regrow it out of, out of my destroyed presences every turn. That's so useful. that's a turn. I need five oh, turns to get through all these. I and all of his board presence, when he spreads new presence, he can use his dead ones. Yeah. yeah. It's good. We can't use ours again, but but um, he can. But it's good because you've got your max energy growth, you've got your maximum yeah. cards per turn. It's quite useful to have all this, your board unlocked. Hmm. Um, all right, so that was the ravage. Then we have the build in the water. So these guys build a town here and a town here. And oh no, 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 they don't build there because um, they the disease, all the disease goes, yeah. goes away, and they don't build here either because the disease goes away. And then they build here a town, and one at the top too. And a town here, here, all right. Okay, that's good to know. Cool. And then they're going to explore ba, 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 all coastal lands. Sure. Okay. So one, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, not this jungle because the wilds get cut up first. Yeah. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. Cool. Cool. Was this a, does this have a wild? How does in disease it? go Just... away? Uh, when they try to build. Yeah. It's blocks one build. Oh, coastal lands. Fuck, coastal lands. We could have done with that fear card about the coastal lands, but lands it's is. gone now. <laughs> now it's gone. We have to get no. all these dead. Okay, we're right. doing all right. Slow powers. What powers? What oh, slow, slow powers. Time. Sure. Mm -hmm. uh, would anyone like to get a minor power? Because you can get one if you want. Who wants one? Yeah, definitely. Go ahead. Grab a minor power. These many crappy tiny marriage money. Yeah, well, I can't talk. All right, you pick with minor power. Meanwhile, my other thing is terrifying chase. Push two explorers and houses uh, and Dahan somewhere else. Um, Ooh, from if you can push a town lands. into where Dahan's are in my land, I can get my Dahan to kill the town. Like this one, for example, if you pushed it north. No, I can I only push stuff that's in my land. So I can push here. I can push here. I can okay. push from here, or I can push from here. These mm. either of these wetlands. Which one would you like me to push everything out of? That's the diff Ooh. that's the difficult one. Well, can... somewhere where they're not going to ravage next turn, I guess. Like, do you want to push this one into one of these Dahan mountains? Yeah, sure. And I'll push this explorer into here. 
I guess. Real quick, Ben, can you look at this card? Does this mean if target land has your presence, do one fear and one damage. If target land is sand or wetlands, do one damage. Does that mean yeah. this card does two damage? If if both those okay. conditions are met, yeah, yeah, then you get two damage. Yeah, but you can one. have either one without the other one. Yeah, I'll take that one. Then. Cool. All right. That was my go. I pushed some invaders. Um, Your slow actions, Ben. Yeah, I've got. Um, I can do shitloads of pushing, and one damage per per house. Um, that's annoying. My furious assault actually has no targets. Um. Target land to push, target land to gather, win one. Oh no, okay, I can gather into this jungle. And then I can do a fury at all the other way. Maybe I should go for the mountains. Well, it's getting hit next. Turn into the wetlands and then the coastals. Yeah. So I will. I can, gather. I can, I can gather out, I can gather this blight out of here. And I can also. Blow up no, this sorry, town. I'm going to do a giga, giga assault. Um, I can bring. Hmm. Oh well, yeah. So I'll gather three there. With um. Uh, I can push four. Push one more somewhere. And well, let's push more. Fine. Okay, so pushing four in. Then I'm going to use uh, Furious Assault to kill one one town for every two huts. So um, boom and boom. Is that a city or a town? Three. Yeah. Let's destroy one city for every three huts in target land. Yeah, but you can't, you can't kill a city, can you? Yeah, the... the did, you have enough, did you have enough... You don't have enough um, yellow... Oh crap! Okay, so what can I do? Um, right, sorry. Let me put two of those fit back and put the city back. So I can kill the town. Um, I need to spend uh, another yellow. It's called to bloodshed, which is one damage per hut. Oh right. Or more damage. Then I can kill it. Kill the city on the explorer. Nice. Oh, well, that works anyway. All right, so they're dead anyway. Did you get all the fear? Right. Yes, you did. Yeah. So oh, there we go. They got yeah, destroyed. Under bloodshed plus lead the furious assault. Just, like, wipes out that that mountain. Nice. Very nice. And uh, now I can just do a couple more pushes and shoves. Um, so how many Start can I do? this shit out. I can do three. Captain Huts here. Yeah, I like right. that. Five... Five more moves. So I'm going to move one over here and then all the other guys like over here. And when I move all these guys, I'll move my smarty with them. Okay. Apparently, um, you have a free sun element you can put out on the board that you're not using. Oh, yeah, you're right. I do. So you did have the thing to use that C. Yeah. I oh, know you don't. You no, don't I still didn't have the four. Oh, you don't have three fire. Yeah. No, you need one more fire. You need another orange. Um, okay, so I can do a couple more pushes. Where do we where do we want to push boys to? Um, uh, we need to start focusing on these over here and these over here. Because we're doing a good job getting out of the middle. And the less middle we have, the less explorers we have. We can just mm -hmm. have them on the coat. So okay. I say either work towards Lewis's well, shit. Here in the mountains, who've just annihilated that city. They're yeah. going to do it attack and go anywhere on the board next turn okay uh, so i've got this card wrapped in wings of sunlight which is move up to five to harm from any land put them in any other land on the board that's five as well that's incredible yeah it's the major power i got this turn it's three and energy so you have to use all your energy on that yeah so I'm just, drop this is just a in. fucking airdrop of Dahan. You've got yeah. XCOMs. This is what this we is. It maneuver steel rain. It always <laughs> comes back down to XCOMs. <laughs> yeah, just it's towards the end of the game. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, um, all right, is that is it time to put I, a go? I did, I'll boys over then. Here. We'll take this place legit. Doubtless you and me could probably defend these. Yeah. Boys. 
I can also, on my slow turn right now, I can kill one one city anywhere around here. Oh, cool. Or one uh, one town, so I'm not sure which one. And then I'll drop pod in wherever we need it. So I say drop pod in one here, because this will just be a giant fight that I can protect against too. Because remember, I have a ton of defense. That's true. So, But these guys actually don't need to come in then. Because yeah. I can... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So they're going to have attack eight. But remember, we have to kill the cities and towns to win. That's the only way we can win. I'm going to nuke this longer... place. Oh. Um, well, <laughs> we're all nukes too. Nukes <laughs> next comes. <laughs> okay, these guys are just going to shimmy up then. Uh, this way. Oh no, if I put them central, then they've got more options next turn. Put them central. Fine. Okay, I'm done. You're done. Uh, so done. I'm not sure which town I should snipe off here. Which one do you think much larger? This is going to turn into a city. I might want to snipe that. What are they hitting doing next turn? They're going to do um, water. Yeah, get yeah. the water place. Uh, that's another fear. One more fear. If we can get one more fear, we can get a card for next turn. That was it. That was all my slow actions. All right. Well, we might be able to get a fear early on. In the fast. I might be able to get a fast fear. Okay. Uh... Should we do the new turn then? Yeah. I can't get a fast fear. That's right. Uh, yeah, let's do a new turn. Sure. All right. I need to put a presence down and get myself two energy mm. and pick a second one. I'm going to pick. I'm going to pick. I don't want to reclaim all my cards. Mm. Oh shit, I forgot to get a power card when I I've played so badly today. I've missed like tons of my abilities. Uh. Um So yeah, sorry, I'm gonna <clears throat> take a print off, get two energy. And then Fested Waters. I'll get a power card and an energy. Underneath the hungry earth. I'll get a major power. Pyroclastic flow. Sounds amazing. I can't do both of these. Damn it. I have lots one. of mountains, aubergines, and fire. I don't really have mountains, aubergines, and fire. Um, oh, this is a power turn. I'm going to love this turn. Oh, no, it's not. Sea monsters. That feels very mean. Sea that sounds amazing. Uh, I want sea monsters. Look at them. They look adorable. They're cute, huh? <laughs> Look at those boys. Oh, this is in three moons. We'll take the sea monsters. That'll keep the English away. Jesus. Oh, I don't have my wombo combo. Oh, no. Giving, giving enough powers out, I think. Um, So I get to reclaim something from the bin. Yep, I'll do this. I'll do this instead. I'll just add another presence. I guess we're doing wasps. So we get wasps and we get absorb corruption. And we get a poisoned land. What's coming up next? What's the next ravage? Uh, coastal lands. Or sea, or sea monsters. Oh, Lewis, are you really norming that territory? Like I need to know where I'm striking. Yeah, I can hit this one for seven. Wow. With a cool, okay. poison the poisoned land. Or sea monsters. I'm just I'm out, I'm just I'm deciding whether I want to send the sea monsters there or the poison. But I think I'll hey, do Mark. the sea monsters. I have a defend four anywhere. So I think I'm gonna put it here. So yeah, I'll put my presence three away in a jungle. One two three in here i will absorb the corruption in it <laughs> and then i will summon bees in here <laughs> and then the bees combined with the sea monsters will freak them the fuck out <laughs> and Are cause the bees in a bladed land cause terrible damage terrible terrible damage nine damage and six no. Oh my god. Holy shit balls. Because it's 
it's just let the sea monsters just come up this way, attack on Titan style, and just wreck the whole the whole place. Brutal. I love it. Right, let's make fast. These are all slow. God, I'm glad I had enough fucking energy. I've just got enough. It's six energy, and I've got six energy on my on my counter. No. Oh, it's fun when you start playing the major powers, isn't it? The major powers are suddenly yeah. like, oh wow! It's like you, you feel <laughs> so weak for so long, and then yeah, and you're able to do it finally. We got some more donations. We got Alpha Cat O Nine um, donate three dollars. Thank you, dude. And says, hey lads. Tom and Ben didn't give me any good icebreakers yesterday. Uh, they only gave me a way to attract Tinder matches. Ooh, I don't have any good icebreakers. P.S. My most successful icebreaker have often ended with dates. Really? Ooh. Holy crap. You need to tell me what you're using. Yeah. I mean, you've got, you've got to understand, we're, we're not the people to ask. You are literally yeah. talking to three nerds who are sat inside <laughs> playing a digital version of a cooperative board game about protecting an island of spirits from the English. Do you have any uh, idea what I look like right now? I'm shirtless in my mm. filthy apartment. <laughs> How about, like, you know, that your your icebreaker is... Have you ever heard of Spirit Island? You, you ever played Spirit Island? <laughs> <laughs> right now, I, I'm that guy. My icebreaker on every Tinder and Bumble matches, I would risk COVID to go on a date. And that's been nailing it every time. So okay. if you want to use that, I risk. I would risk COVID to go on a date. Yeah. With you. With yeah. you. Oh right. You look so great. I'd. I'm, yeah. I could. I could get ill. I. Yeah, I'd let you give me a possibly fatal disease. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, it's charming. <laughs> <laughs> I'd let you infect me. Mm. Yeah. yeah, that's the working, best advice I can give the girl is just be yourself, treat them like a person, and then ask if they want to hang out one on one. And usually that implies, if not, then whatever. You got a usually friend. No. Yeah, usually I don't no. really believe in um, like sort of one liners, pick up lines kind yeah. of thing. And you're the only one who's procreated out of all of us. So. <laughs> yeah. All right, are you ready to go? Fast actions. Um, yeah, do you want to go first? Yeah, oh shit, my sea monsters aren't going to go off this turn, but they will go off eventually. Um, sure, fast actions are wasps. I put some bees here. Mm -hmm. uh, yoink. And then I can do one damage per bees. So I think I'll do it here and kill this explorer so they don't add a blight here. Okay. Um, and that would have cascaded two more blights. So I feel like yeah. the bees have done a good job. And oh, saved. no, again. Oh, blight. fuck, I can't. No, but they already had bees there. Bees were already there. I added yeah, the bees the, here. Eat, the bees eat people is also no blight. Oh, fuck. I, hang, well, on, hang on, let me fast play first. Let me fast play all first. All right, fine. Oh, uh, yeah, Dad, destroy, can you do a blight, can you? I'm going to destroy one of my things, and you can remove any blight. Okay, Lewis. fine. Blight dead. Oh, this job guy, man. dead. Job done. Okay, thank you, Dad. Yay. We did it. Okay, that's good news. Because that would have triggered for this time and coastal time, and it's just too much, mm -hmm. too much shit. Nip that in the blood. In Nip the bud. Nip that in, in the, the bloody. Blood. Well, in that case, I'll put the beast here as well and kill this other guy, so that way they can't even build. Oh, and then you won't build. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Oh, but that is, that is less damage here. And they're going to build here as well. Well, All I can right. drop pod in if, if that's required. Uh, no, fine. We'll put we'll keep the explorer there and let them build there, and then I'll deal with it next turn. All right, fine. Uh, sorry, I need to put another explorer back here. This is bad, bad, bad practice. But that is my fast actions done. Ben, mm -hmm. do you have any? Um, right. So my my fast is that is the drop pod. Um, where do we need it? Are you you're taking care of the wetlands, right? So I don't need to go there. I'm not. Curious. I'm taking care of that. Yeah. Okay, you are okay. Um, uh, so where's the next biggest clump of boys? Probably either here in the mountains, here in the, the, the town. I don't know if we need the drop pod this turn. Oh. The green well, pouring I think you might have to save it. It might be worth yeah. saving it for something else for another turn. I've already done it. I've done it now. Here they come! <laughs> one, one didn't make... One didn't make one shot down by enemy fire! <laughs> come in! 
<laughs> oh. Two came in, we killed one. <laughs> okay. No, that's oh, fine. This is all fine. Attack pattern alpha. Okay. Um and then I've got a defend three I can put down somewhere. And I've put defense two everywhere that I have awesome. stuff. So, um where are those defense tokens? Where'd you get them from? I just uh, make them out of here. The state bag and then you just So um there we go, there's one there. And there's one there, which is a seven. That's a good. seven. Yeah, because the drop pods come in with five. Wow. And then, um, then I get two. Um, anywhere else getting attacked where I've got presence? No, that's it. Okay. All right, fine. Um, All right, right, then. And I'll, I'll stick a defend. No, uh, that's, that's it. Any wow, fast, okay. any more fast? No? Yeah, I get to remove a blight. And I have to defend. I'm not sure which blade I want to remove. I'm thinking either this one to stop more cascades or this one in case there's a rabbit. Oh, Remember shit. I can do fast things on my go. I can push. I mean, you can move all your animals presence And I can gather to a presence. Um, can I push within one? Yeah. So I can, I can push. All right. So what I'm going to actually do is I can actually... I don't. I can. I can do the bees here. We can do the bees yeah. here, and that way I can just push these guys in here. This works better. All right. Okay. This works also, better. girls like it when you show interest. Guys, don't beat around the bush. I was thinking about that with the other pickup line. Don't just beat show interest. The bush. If she doesn't like you, move on. All right. Jesus, fucking <laughs> Casanova. All right. It's fine. I was thinking. Um, <laughs> No, good. We didn't get the fear. We didn't get a fear done. Did anyone kill anything? No, I guess I not. Nothing. Okay, that's a shame. But it doesn't matter. Uh, events or what? No, what do we do first? First, we lose a presence. So delete yourself. Delete your presence mm. off yourself. Delete. Oh, by mountain. I'm gonna get rid of this presence up here. Um, cool. And then we get an event. Bam. Blighted land. Festering pits of blight on each board with invaders. Add one blight to a land with at least two blight, but do not cascade. Okay, that's not too bad. We've only got like two territories like that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's well, that's a lot of healing. pretty bad. Get There's quite here. a lot of yeah. blight there now, but that's fine. Uh, then on each board, add a plague, um, but ignore plague during builds this invader phase. So right. we don't know where the, where we want the plagues really, do we? Um, uh, these plague. Yeah, because we don't know where they're invading. Actually, no, that's build, so it's all coastal lands, right? No, but it says on the card. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so I don't know. I guess I guess I'll put mine here. We haven't had a. This is an We haven't had a mountain or a, a jungle town in forever. Yeah. I'll put one on this forest. Fuck it. Same. Oh, Lewis, you lose this uh, presence here because of the blight. Oh, shit. Um, right, and there... Lewis is running out presence. This is a big deal. One fear per land where Dahan outnumber towns. Um, uh, one fear per land where Dahan outnumber towns. Yeah, that's one. That's it, isn't it? It's just Dead. one. Yeah. Oh, that okay, well, that's over. God. Okay, good. We get a fear. Uh, level two fear. Each player removes one explorer and one town from land with beasts. Or mm. one explorer from a land adjacent to beasts. Or all the beasts. So we can remove... Well, this is Strike Force Alpha over here already. But we could do something over here. Yeah, the beasts... Like, Lewis, can you wipe this out over here? Yeah. They're going to be leftovers. Well, there's going to be nine, twelve. It's going to be twelve damage there. Oh right, they're, they're all fucked then. Um, in that case, we can kill, like, this guy, one of these guys. Yeah, kill one of these guys. Kill this guy. Yeah. Kill this guy. So we're going to do it three times. So let's do. Yeah, well, they're like... going to build in coastal cities, right? So we don't. We want to get rid of oh, this, yeah. guy, this guy. This guy. This guy. We could save our disease here too for this explorer. Yeah, I like that. And then um 
And then one more. Get rid of this guy here, because then now they're only one explorer. They can't. Sure. They can't, can't ravage it. it. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, this one has a disease block in this building. This is this right. is fine. That was a good one. Too many monsters, it says. Okay, now that's there go. So they're going to ravage the waterway. So we are going to get a blight in strike strike post alpha. Yep, that's fine. Um, they try to ravage the this coast up here, but the drop pod attack annihilates them. Ah! Oh, Deltos, do you want to do you lose a presence to stop the blight coming down? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. And then over here, they try to they try to blight, but I've got defenses and the Dahan eat them all up. Nom nom nom. Um, and that's it. Wetlands secured. All right. Then they build in the coastal lands. They don't build here. Uh, they build a new city here. No problem though. I've got that locked down. Uh, they oh don't God. build here. And I they think don't we're build... about to win. They don't build it feels here. like it, doesn't it? Um, but now they're going to... They do build the here. Actually, but that's fine. Then they explore the mountains. Go oh, on. no, they don't build there because of disease. Oh, cool. Oh, no, yeah. disease doesn't work. It's lingering. Oh, it's this turn. Disease. Sorry, yeah, put that back. That's all right. Um, right. Explore okay. mountains are going to do so. Uh, that's boop, 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 boop. Oh, uh, shit, all of them. Yeah. Oh, well. Good. That's what happens. Right, then they're done. Now it's our slow boys. All right. Okay, so now the sea monsters invade. Yay! Go sea monsters. On a coastal sea tile. Monsters. Godzilla. I add a, I add go, a beast go Godzilla. to this coastal tile. And then that's four beasts. So for each beast, two fear and three damage. Oh my god. So eight fear and 12 damage, which kills everything. Hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six damage for... Six fear for killing and eight fear. So it's 14 fear in total. 14 fear, yes. That was very scary. They were, they saw the sea monsters and the bees in the back, and they were just like, I cannot believe this is happening. Well, it's just bees and alligators and sea monsters and Godzilla's here it's too. Fully just... And a friendly crocodile with his bear friend. Yeah. It's all can, we get, can we get like a big one to be a sea monster? There we go. <laughs> stomp, stomp, stomp. They just squashed two cities. They just godzilla the whole coast. <laughs> That's amazing. I love it. All right. So that guy's a fear card. Mm. Yeah. Oh, is that, that, so not quite a, the, the, the winning fear, though. If we can get 10 more fear, I reckon we can win. Oh, the then we'll have no cities and win. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's see. What else have we got for slow boys? Oh, for other slow boys, I've got um, gather a, bl a blight and remove a blight. So... Mm. Where are they? Where are they ravaging next? Oh, no, that's an ore. Oh no, yeah, no, 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 you know, I could do green, both because I've got two yeah. green. Um, yeah. where do we want to get rid of it? I don't know. So I can pay an energy. Oh, over here. Oh no, I can't pay an energy. I can only gather one. Shit. All right, because I spent all my six. Oh, and it's range zero. Yeah. All so right. Well, I guess I just have to gather this one to here. Oh, could you do it? The other one, the desert one instead. Yeah, I'd love to. I does that fucking kill me? Uh, no, you still have yeah, presences like, left. I think that's fine. Does that kill my my dude when I gather it to myself? I think so. Yeah. Because it's no, not because you don't place that flight. Oh, okay, then you're good. All right, fine. Okay, that's but good. You get rid of one, don't you? I can't. Oh, so I have to pay an energy, and I don't actually have an energy left. Because oh, I spent it all on this card. Sea monsters. White sea monsters <laughs> was very expensive. Um, uh, sweet. Have you got any more slow stuff? You've got your frenzied assault. Can you do that? No, I haven't got a moon, so I can't. Oh, okay. A moon. Oh. No, I didn't. I didn't play a moon this this turn. Okay. So, so my slow boys is just um, move huts and then destroy destroy towns near huts. So I can kill. Uh, what's the range on it? Range zero. Um, 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 yeah. Don't know. Oh no, I can move over here. I can get like these boys moving over, and then yeah, move I was gonna move those guys too, and then kill this hut. 
Oh, good. if you can move the wall with no, me. No, no, you, you go. But if well, you can that's move... on my slope. Yeah. Because I can only move... Um, how many? One per purple and yellow. So, oh, no, I can move all of them. That's cool. Okay. I've got enough moves. Because I have another push, one or three. One town or three people. Maybe I'll, I'll push can... these guys over here. As long as there's five together, they can always drop pod. Yeah. They can always drop pod. <laughs> Right. Drop pod to hand. These final, these final major powers are nuts, aren't they? But it's why you want to sort of kettle buildings and the invaders together into like, you want to shove them all into the same area so you can drop bombs on them. Mm. Um, is that all your slow actions? Uh, yep. All right, so I'm going to do. Oh wait, this doesn't work the way I thought it did. Do one... The eternal <laughs> cry of the Spirit Island player. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hang on a second. This actually, I this doesn't actually work like I thought it did. Yeah, I completely fucked up, yeah, guys. Yeah, I messed um... up. It says target land any, but it also says that uh, it has to be a, a a water or a far or desert, and it yeah. also has to have my uh, presence in it. I <laughs> fucked up all that. It's stupid, basically what it? I'm saying. So I. Uh... I use that. I kill this one explorer here because it's the only thing that I can do now. Because I messed. Um, I can push three to Han anywhere, so I'm going to push three to Han into here. Like that. Uh, I get to stem the flow of fresh water, so on a mountain or a sand, it does an extra damage. So I'm doing it twice here to this mountain, killing this town. Um, I have infested aquifers. If target land has any blight, one damage to each invader there. Uh, and if uh, target is mountain or water, add uh, a fear and a blight. So... You've replaced your Dahan with drop pod troops. I've got space marine drop pods now. I love this. <laughs> <laughs> you like hold on. Like, zoom in on them. Make them bigger. Yeah, yeah. Up. Very Can cool. We get a... Can we get a... Um... As well, uh, scale up. It's plus. Okay, so there we go. So I'm just gonna add a fear and a blight, uh, and put a blight. Where is that? Right here. We'll take one off the fear. And then uh, I'm going to use my awesome power to do three damage anywhere I want, and I'm just gonna ping off this town right here. That's my turn. So we only have one town left, minus all these ones getting built in a second. Yeah, dude, it's amazing. Did you do the the fear for them? Oh yeah, one fear, and then one fear for the other town. We're in six. Oh, where did you did you have it in a saved object? You did. You must. Have <laughs> yeah, <done. I> did. <laughs> oh, I've got like an epic army saved <laughs> when I was playing an epic on tabletop. Mm. Oh my god! All right. Um... That is that, I guess. We get six more fear. And I think then we've won, right? Pretty much. I think I think we got this in the bag, guys. We're like yeah, right we've really there. On them, haven't we? I think we've done a we've done a number on them. Um I think we've we've got it we got it definitely got it under control. There's a ten turn two, I thought we were knackered. I thought we were in trouble as well, but I think that the way this game builds up is like you feel like you can't control everything and then suddenly you start getting powerful. Uh, yeah. Although I am running out of fucking presences. Yeah, literally like three more turns and you're like, you're done. Yeah. <laughs> Bit spooky. But we got to stop uh, because it's eight o'clock. So I think we'll uh, say... Well, I think we'll say... Like, do one more turn? That was... Well, what, to, to just get this done? Just to like... Get to finish. If you're allowed, Ben, I know you're you yeah, have a family. No, I um, I warned them that uh, you know, the Spirit Island like takes minutes. longer than three hours. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. Hey, what a fucking what a fucking like, game. What do they call that? You have a you have a great deal going on. Sorry, kids. Sorry, wife. I'm gonna go in the garage and play three hours of board games. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Great racket. Um, yeah, well, you know, it's work. I could, I, my job. Yeah. <laughs> it's not, I'm not doing it for fun. <laughs> ah, it's still fun, though. <laughs> In fact, if we just kill this town, we've just won anyway. We don't even well, need the fear. 
Do we have like a fast move? A fast house move? Um, fast house killer? Yeah, I reckon I can get some wolves in there. I can push some wolves in there and eat that eat that town on my first action. Oh, there's no blight there? So if you just get some presents down... I've got presents here. Um, oh. So I can just gather Is wolves to here. Oh yeah, that's it, literally. You don't even need to cast a spell. You're just like, get them, boys. Nom. Yeah, I do. I need to have... I can just draw up my hand, though, and just play enough to do the nom, the nom attack. Mm -hmm. um, I can just play some wasps in there for good measure. <laughs> yeah. Put some can wasps. you do another Godzilla just for fun? Uh, no, I don't have enough energy for that. That costs five. Um, but I can... Oh, I might be able to, actually. Yeah, because this gives me two plus three, so I will have five. I could just no, but God's it is slow. That's the problem. I want it needs to be fast. We need we need the speed bees and the wolf attack to kill this town, sink it to the ocean. That's it. That's the last town. We don't even need the six sphere. That's win. Yeah. That's the victory, right Literally, there. We can, so we can there win before we even get a chance to act. Yeah. Spirit Island saved. Oh, go. these are these are some sea monsters. Well, it wasn't Godzilla. It was G G what's his name? Gajira. Gajira. <laughs> Why didn't you bring these out earlier? What the fuck I are these? I didn't just remember they were there. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some three space fucking hydras against Gajira. <laughs> <laughs> Set up on the beach, guys. Well, they're not that big. Christ. <laughs> Pretty big. They're superhuman. These are like little dogs now. They're like little yeah. cute little hydra dogs. This is too scale. What if they were like this? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look how just... cute they are. Space Marines are like kicking the dogs. Look how cute Run they are. Good. Like you, they want load. You like you could three of them can feed like a, the same dog at once. Oh. More realistic, like this, right? You think that's good scale? Yeah, probably. Because they are still space marines. They're pretty big. Oh, oh no, the orcs are here. <laughs> Not the orcs. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Where did you get these from? <laughs> They've got proper animations and shit. This is a bit weird. These are like the least intimidating orcs I've ever looked at. They're a bit smiley face, aren't they? <laughs> they look like they do yoga. <laughs> yeah. It's like World of Warcraft uh, 2002. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, that's Spirit uh, Island. Holy yeah. Crap. So we uh, actually, we didn't even need to take another turn because Lewis can just insta insta give the last town and. That's I it. I felt like an absolute noob playing this, but I felt like I got it towards the end. All I do yeah. is run wolves at things. After your I first two or three turns, you totally got the hang of it and just dominated the, your your whole region. There was a turn. There was a few turns where you guys were moving around my wolves, and I was like, "Oh, I'm, I'm not sure. I believe I'm not sure I'm okay with this." And then there was that turn where you were like, "Let's get rid of all the wolves. We only need like <laughs> we only need like three of them. They don't do anything, right?" That was um, the turning point. And I was actually, like, yeah. "What are you saying? I that is my whole thing." <laughs> yeah, just kill me, I guess. That's great. <laughs> Decide as a group to kill. Um, there was that. That happened in the middle, but we got through it as a team. Um, yeah, and I just... we did it. Sorry. I want some super nerd to go through the VOD and figure out every error we did and just have like a counting. There's going to be such a long list of things yeah. we've done wrong. Holy crap! With um, um, the main thing we did wrong was with England. We only did their escalation rule. I don't think we did the other rules. Well, I think we did because there were four... I think it automatically added four fear cards. So it automatically made it harder to get to this point. Oh, so, okay. I mean, so we did have an extra fear card added by default. And we um, were only level one. And we also did the building boom. So we did do... Yeah, we did the building extra boom. Build. Yeah. And we, we, we paid attention to the additional loss condition. So... That's true. Yeah. We did okay. I think it. I don't think we only really did level one anyway, right? We didn't do level two. Yeah, I'm. I'm pretty impressed with though how we pulled that back. I thought it was a lose for sure. We definitely did do this indentured fight. servants earn land thing. Invader build actions affect lands without invaders if they're adjacent to two or more towns before the build action. I don't really understand what it says, but we did do that. Yeah, if they build, they get free builds in adjacent territories. I <laughs> am Giga Explorer. Oh, no. I have claimed the island. <laughs> get him get him gojira you cannot defeat me gojira 
<laughs> do, do, do. Gojira fights with such honor and wit. <laughs> you have defeated me, Gojira. Uh, I died. Also, also, I die. Oh, the spirit no. island goes back. Okay, who gets the honor? As I think as Lewis did the killing blow. Yeah. Stronghold. He gets the honor of the table flip. Oh, the holy table flip. <laughs> oh, 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 goodbye. Oh, 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 sort of all just falls onto like a crappy jungle pathway. This looks like a oh, shitty okay. Google um, street oh, view. Oh, come back. So there's a portal. We've got infinity fall. Yeah. Oh. Um, Some say they're falling to this day. Thank you, everybody. Um, that was that was that a game. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, me, we're going to do another tabletop sort of um, game on uh, Sunday afternoon. I'm really into them at the moment. We're going to play Root. Um, Ooh, hopefully, we'll get Riddy and Embree and Alex and Brian because it's a six-player game. So th Oof. that might be You're fun. Not gonna finish in three hours. <laughs> <That's for laughs> sure. Well, we're going to have to. We're going to have to, Ben, um, <laughs> right. because okay. high rollers are on after us. So yes, that's what we're going to try and do on Sunday. Um, we have played it before, at least some of us have. Really, and hasn't. So I reckon people who haven't played before should be the uh, the bandits, the va the vagabond, vagabond. Yeah, they're the easiest. They're very no. straightforward. Yeah, very easy. That's what Alex easy. was, and he won last night when we were running through it. Yeah, I think it's quite strong. So probably good if the new player plays it. Um, yeah, new player not be the birds. <laughs> like holy shit. Yeah. Birds are complicated. Uh, anyway, I I'm looking forward to that. Thank you for joining me and Ben tonight. Stay tuned for uh, we're gonna host someone now. I think and uh, we don't have anyone on the schedule. It's just this host Ridley, and he's just... playing XCOM. It's like the same fuck. Oh, there you go. If you enjoyed this, yeah. perfect. Um, and then I'll be back tomorrow afternoon with Ravs. We're gonna play Outward. Uh, Yay. for the new DLC for a few hours. Hopefully, hopefully if they send it through to us. Which they did promise, but I might buy I, that game. That looks interesting. It's good playing it with a friend. You need a friend. Don't do yeah. it on your own. Oh, okay. All right. Oh. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Rip Not saying that you don't have any friends, but I wouldn't just play it on your own. I'd play it with someone. Um, it's much better with with a, with a chum to to experience it with you. All right. Cheers, guys. Have a good night. Goodbye. Thank you. I do have to stop stream myself. I'll do that. All right. Bye. 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 Bye.